for the latest updates in Major League Baseball. 105 p.m. New York Yankees taking the Toronto Blue Jays. Yankees on Serious 208, XM 175, and Internet 858. Blue Jays on Internet 868. 110 p.m. Detroit Tigers take on the Oakland A's. Tigers on Serious 209, XM 176, and Internet 849. Athletics on Internet 859. 2.20 p.m. Chicago Cubs take on the LA Dodgers. Cubs on Serious 210, XM 177, and Internet 844. Dodgers on Internet 853. Spanish broadcast on Internet 870. 10 p.m. Colorado Rockies take on the Tampa Bay Rays. Rockies on Series 11, XM 178, and Internet 848. Rays on Internet 866. 412 p.m. Pittsburgh Pirates take on the Baltimore Orioles. Pirates on Series 106, XM 179, and Internet 861. Orioles on Internet 842. 435 p.m. San Francisco Giants take on the San Diego Padres. Giants on Series 119, XM 180, and Internet 863. Padres on Internet 862. 640 p.m. Cincinnati Reds take on the New York Mets. Reds on Series 138, XM 175 and Internet 846. That's on Internet 857. 6.45 p.m. Washington Nationals take on the Philadelphia Phillies. Nationals on Series 208, XM 176 and Internet 869. Phillies on Internet 860. 7.20 p.m. Atlanta Braves take on the Arizona Diamondbacks. Braves on Series 209, XM 177 and Internet 841. Diamondbacks on Internet 840. 7.40 p.m. Kansas City Royals take on the Chicago Cubs. Royals on Series 210, XM 181 and Internet 851. White Sox on Internet 845. 8.05 p.m. Texas Orlando Rangers take on the Houston Astros. The Rangers on Sirius 85, XM 182 and Internet 867. Astros on Internet 850. Spanish broadcast on Sirius 132, XM 183, Internet 871. 8.10 p.m. Milwaukee Brewers take on the Seattle Mariners. Brewers on Sirius 121, XM 184, Internet 855. Mariners on Internet 864. 9.30 p.m. LA Angels take on the Boston Red Sox. Angels on Sirius and XM Channels 89, Internet 852. Red Sox on Internet 843. I'm Frank Sackman, but with your serious XM MLB schedule for Friday, April the 5th. All times are Eastern, and please remember, all games, times, and channels are subject to change. Check SiriusXM.com for the latest updates. In Major League Baseball, 105 p.m. New York Yankees take on the Toronto Blue Jays. Yankees on Sirius 208, XM 175, and Internet 858. Blue Jays on Internet 868. 110 p.m. Detroit Tigers take on the Oakland A's. Tigers on Sirius 209, XM 176, and Internet 849. Athletics on Internet 859. 2.20 p.m. Chicago Cubs. Cubs take on the LA Dodgers. The way, Cubs on Series 210, XM 177, and Internet 844. Dodgers on Internet 853. Spanish broadcast on Internet 870. 410 p.m. Colorado Rockies take on the Tampa Bay Rays. Rockies on Series 211, XM 178, and Internet 848. Rays on Internet 866. 412 p.m. Pittsburgh Pirates take on the Baltimore Orioles. Pirates on Series 106, XM 179, and Internet 861. Orioles on Internet 842. 435 p.m. San Francisco Giants take on the San Diego Padres. Giants on Series 119, XM 180, and Internet 863. Padres on Internet 862. 6.40 p.m. Cincinnati Reds take on the New York Mets. Reds on Series 138, XM 175, and Internet 846. Mets on Internet 857. 6.45 p.m. Washington Nationals take on the Philadelphia Phillies. Nationals on Series 208, XM 176, and Internet 869. Phillies on Internet 860. 7.20 p.m. Atlanta Braves take on the Arizona Diamondbacks. Braves on Series 209, XM 177, and Internet 841. Diamondbacks on Internet. Internet 840. 7.40 p.m. Kansas City Royals take on the Chicago Cubs. Royals on Series 210, XM 181, and Internet 851. White Sox on Internet 845. 8.05 p.m. Texas Rangers take on the Houston Astros. Rangers on Series 85, XM 182, and Internet 867. Astros on Internet 8. Hopefully he will play Sunday against the Utah Jazz. GP2 is available. He was listed as questionable earlier today with left ankle soreness, but he will give it a go tonight. Dario Sharich out with a right knee lateral joint pain and Andrew Wiggins who twisted his ankle in the second half against Houston last night he is out with left ankle soreness so Moses Moody will get the start for the Golden State Warriors tonight with no Andrew Wiggins and no Jonathan Kaminga transaction wise in the NBA, the Philadelphia 76ers have been fined 100 GER for violating league policy injury reporting rules for failing to accurately disclose the game availability status of Joel Embiid prior to their game against the Oklahoma City Thunder on April 2nd, in which Embiid was listed as out the day prior. Of course, he played in that game, played well in that game, and the Sixers won, and then they won again last night. And also the day after dropping 41 points in the Blue Coats playoff loss, the Sixers converted former Warrior Jeff Doughton 
to a standard deal. He played a, a handful of games with the Golden State Warriors in the 21-22 season on a two-way contract before he was let go. Good to see Jeff Doughton get an extended shot in the NBA. So we'll take another break. Come on back here on the 95.7 The Game Warriors Radio Network, presented by United Airlines. Dine at the Copper Skillet for a tasty bite. Family owned since 1973 in a Bay Area local in downtown Martinez. Serving classic American diner food the right way. Juicy burgers, hearty omelets, and breakfast all day. The Copper Skillet, where hungry people come to eat. Want more speed? Well, Xfinity just increased their internet speeds, and they're faster than ever. It's time to get more out of your internet with faster speeds from Xfinity. Now through June 21st, get 150 megabit Xfinity internet for only $19.99 a month for 12 months with a one-year contract. That's double the speed for the same great price. Click, call, or visit a store today. Requires paperless billing and auto pay with store bank account. Restrictions apply. Equipment, taxes, and other charges extra. After promo, regular rates apply. Actual speeds vary. You can start a career that allows you to work with purpose, pays great, has outstanding benefits, and offers a promising future. The Alameda County Probation Department is seeking dedicated people to make a difference as a like juvenile button? institutional Come officer on, associate, like working with youth in facilities, too. playing Join a critical role as a mentor, role model, and life coach to youth while ensuring safety. Apply for a career as a juvenile institutional officer associate with Alameda County Probation, where we could use your help to build a great tomorrow today. Apply at joinacpd.org. With heating bills as high as they are, proper weatherproofing is essential. If you're working with a client to upgrade or build a new home, be sure to visit Golden State. They partner with respected brands such as Owens Corning and James Hardy for insulation and siding, as well as Marvin and Anderson for energy-efficient windows. They're a great option for a comfortable home with lower energy bills. Visit GoldenStateLumber.com. Family-owned since 1954. Golden State. When you succeed, we succeed. Do you have a child who doesn't listen or tunes you out? Is a teacher telling you that your child may need extra support? Tune in every Saturday morning at 7.30 for Parenting with Vanessa Colon. 20 years of expertise empowering parents with the tools they need on 95.7 The Game. Have you tried Farmers Brewing yet? If not, it's time you put your lips on a farmer. From sunup to sundown, we're working hard to create beers from our own farm-grown ingredients. Farmers Brewing is 100% family-owned with five generations of experiences with incorporation of tradition and innovation. The results, sessionable style beers that are clean, crisp, and easy drinking for all. From centuries of farmers to future generations of brewers, it's been a long time coming and we're here to stay. From farm to glass, we're Farmers Brewing. Find us at your local store or visit FarmersBrewing.com. What go best with the Warriors win? Free cookies! And not just one cookie or two cookie, but three free cookies! When the Golden State Warriors Remember, win, get hit one that free like pack of cookies. Tungus make sure cookies, you vote. Tungus love tonight. free cookies, even know. most of Get that W, Warriors. AM, PM, too much good stuff. Proud partner of the Golden State Warriors. Only 1,000 deals available on the AM, PM map for 24 hours on a first-come, first-served basis between October 18, 2022 and April 10, 2023. Only for participating AM, PM stores while supplies last. Everyone circle up. I know it looks rough out there. Sure, we're down 119 Did you hit the like button? Come but we on, came hit here the to like play button. differently. We need a game Join changer. Something like Ring Central, the business phone system that's more than a phone. I want you to communicate like you can talk to anyone, anywhere, all from the same app. Now get out there and play like you're using Ring Central. Ring Central, simpler communications. Whether on or off the court, the keys to success are the same. On the court, it's ball movement. Off the court, it's workflow. On the court, teams call plays to execute their game plan. Off the court, companies rely on systems to run their business smoothly. MRC Smart Technology Solutions, a Xerox company, is the official copier and office solutions provider of the Golden State Warriors. We offer large and small companies the technology they need to transform the way they work. Visit MRC360.com to learn more today. Bay's team is back on the Golden State Warriors Radio Network. Presented by United Airlines. Hippity hops to the rim. Goes a block by Draymond. What a block by Draymond. Flash Brothers live here. Curry trying to get free of Westbrook. Ball goes right side. Clay, quick release. Splash! Unbelievable lives here. Curry gets it from midcourt. Pulls up for a three on the way. Got it! Curry nailed it! He hit a three at the buzzer! Unbelievable. Elevation sensation lives here. Fly! A little 
Elimination sensation for Kaminga. It's game time, Dub Nation. It's game time, Dub Nation. It's game time, Dub Nation. Lock in and turn the volume up. Takes a three. Oh, my goodness. Curry just dropped the mic and get it over with. Ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming. And the rocket's right. Nice rendition there of the national anthem. Kevin Dana filling in for Tim Roy. We got to take one more break. And as Tim would say, it's time for our last break before basketball. We'll come on back with the starters and the tip right here on the 95.7 of the Game Warriors Radio Network presented by United Airlines. When you pick up some scratches because you want a fun break, the playful way you scratch is the next choice you should make. You can make your dog's leg kick and scratch with that. You could even grab a laser pointer and use your cap. You can build yourself a homemade scratching machine or use a piece from your chest set. Go ahead, grab the queen. Scratch like a DJ with your record play. A cactus could scratch off that scratchable layer because when it comes to scratching, there's a million playful ways. Thanks to scratches from the California lottery, a little play can make your day. Please play responsibly. Must be 18 years or older to purchase, play, or claim. Flowing Water Plumbing and Drain brings over six decades of plumbing expertise to the Bay Area. Whether it's service plumbing or new construction, residential or commercial projects, they've got you covered. And they provide free estimates with no show-up fees. And you have the option to choose between hourly or flat rate pricing. Call 8444-FLOH2O. That's 8444-FLOH2O. Flowing water, plumbing, and drain. Your trusted local plumber. 8444-FLOH2O. When something happens to your car, you might say, No! My car! But what you really need to say is something that can actually help. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. And just like that, State Farm is there to help you file your claim right on the State Farm mobile app. So just remember, like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. State Farm, Bloomington, Illinois. Bring the family out this spring to enjoy the fully bloomed activities in Thrive City. Work up a sweat in weekly fitness classes or jam out with your tots in the Little Bears music class. You can challenge your smarts with friends during harmonic trivia nights. Then turn up the fun for First Fridays at Thrive City every month. Get your daily dose of iron on golf day. Thrive City will always have something for you. Be sure to check out the full lineup of free events at thrivecity.com. Some say New York had the greatest lineup ever back in 27. Though Woodstock in 69 was pretty spectacular. Then again, there was Chicago in 98. But perhaps the most impressive ever is the full line of Mercedes-Benz electric vehicles. Choose from a growing list of models like the versatile and spacious EQB with an optional third row, the stunning EQS available with an EPA-estimated range of up to 350 miles per charge, or the roomier EQS SUV with off-road mode to tackle varied terrain. The visionary technology of Mercedes-Benz has made its way to electric. These intelligent electric vehicles factor in charging stations, charging duration, weather, topography, and your personal driving style when estimating your arrival time. Visit MBUS com or your local dealer to experience the luxury of electric today. Visit your local Bay Area Mercedes-Benz dealers for a test drive today or visit us on the web at bayareamercedes.com. Whatever the motivation has been for each one individually, whether you're looking at below or up or wherever you're looking, keep looking there because it's a matter of us 
maintaining this momentum because more than likely it's going to be, you know, you have to win one game to stay alive, you know, in a couple weeks. So I don't really care what anybody's looking at. Just keep our focus on what we've been doing as the results have been able to, to show we're, we're locked in and we're motivated. That's Stephen Curry talking about the Warriors needing to keep the momentum heading into the play because likely they're going to be in a, a win or out situation. They could potentially get up to eight where they'd have two cracks at it, and that's the hope to at least get up to that eight spot so you can at least get two shots of getting into the postseason and at, least, at the very worst, hosting the 8-9 game. So here we go. Let's give you our racket and starting lineups. And again, we mentioned it earlier, with no Jonathan Kaminga, with no Andrew Wiggins, Moses Moody is getting his 10th start of the season, averaging 8.2 points and three rebounds per game at nine points last night. That snapped the streak of four straight games in double figures for Moses Moody. Draymond Green, Trace Jackson Davis, Clay Thompson, and Stephen Curry rounding out the starting five. Stephen Clay combining for 58, 29 apiece in the 23 point win over the, the like Rockets button? in Space on, City the last like night. Steve Kerr too. in Join his 10th family. season at the helm, 515 and 272, his record as the head coach of the Golden State Warriors. Jason Kidd in his third year as Dallas's head coach was sent out the following five. Again, two normal starters, Derek Lively and Luka Doncic out. Well, I guess Lively was replaced in the starting lineup by Daniel Gafford a little bit before he got injured. But anyways, Derek Jones Jr., P.J. Washington, Daniel Gafford, Dante Exum, who has revived his career here in Dallas after playing in EuroLeague the last couple of seasons. He's shooting 50% from three this season. And Kyrie Irving, no Luka Doncic as we get ready to jump it up. And the tap is controlled. Oh, it was touched by Trace Jackson Davis, but he bats it out of play. So it'll be Dallas basketball. Give you quickly our CarMax keys to the game. Golden State needs to hit some threes against this Dallas defense. That has been spectacular this year. And also pound the glass. Dallas has been better Recently rebounding the basketball. No rebound to be had on the Kyrie back cut to lay it in. Makes it 2 nothing off the feet up top from Daniel Gafford. But if they can still own the glass, as they say rebounding wins championships. And the Warriors have the basketball down 2 nothing. Those were our CarMax keys of the game. Stephen Curry to the right wing for a Moses Moody triple. That is short. Rebound on the weak side. Corralled by Draymond. Out to Clay. Shot fake to let Exum fly by. And he's short on the left wing. Three. Gafford the rebound. And it's in the hands of Dante Exum, former number five overall pick in 2014 by the Utah Jazz. Has it up top, flings it inside the left wing arc for Daniel Gafford. Guarded there by Jackson Davis, weak side. Draymond Green almost came by to steal it, but he sensed it just in time. Gafford hears Exum on a right alley drive, scoop to the hoop. High Archer drops in over Draymond Green. Nicely done by Dante Exum, who's averaging eight points per game. It's 4 0 Dallas, a minute gone by. Stephen Curry around the basket underneath. The bounce pass goes to Moses Moody. Now Draymond Green back to step right wing. Feeds a cutting Moses Moody going up over Gafford. No good. Nice rim protection by Gafford, who averages more than two blocks per game. And it's PJ Washington coming the other way. Takes it to the right wing, trying to post up Gafford, but it's knocked away by Trace Jackson. Jackson Davis with the deflection. 10.44 to go first quarter. Dallas 4, Golden State nothing. 19 on the timer for the Horsies. So here's Dante Exum on the right baseline with it. Looking to get it in, feeding Kyrie in the corner. He's got Moses on him who snatches it, momentarily knocks it out of play. The defense by Moses. They will have to reinsert it. Now this time near the corner on the right side of the floor for Kyrie Irving. Inbounds pass over the head of Daniel Gafford. It's stolen by Draymond Green. Deflecting the inbounds pass. Gets it back from Steph. Goes to Moody for a left angle three. In the air, and he's hacked in the act by Kyrie. Three freebies coming up for Moses Moody. Well, Steve Kerr, after the win yesterday, said that the Warriors are getting on a roll towards the end of the season. I just know that our defense um, is playing at the best level it has all year. We haven't won six games in a row until now all year, so um, it's probably the best we've played. But, you know, I've been kind of sharing that with you guys over the last couple of months that I've felt like we could rattle off ten in a row at any time. And, you know, it's um, I know it's late in the year, but um, if we keep going, keep winning, it'll be it'll be a lot of fun to have a shot, um, you know, in the postseason. So we gotta got to keep plugging away. Moses hit the first free throw. Here comes the second. It is up and it is good. He's got one more coming for the 81% foul shooter, the Little Rock native. He'll be turning 22 
in about seven weeks on May 31st. Two of three free throwing for Moses Moody, missing the third. It's 4-2 Dallas leading Golden State. Here comes Kyrie walking it through the Mavericks logo in midcourt. A bounce pass to the left wing for Exum. Off to the right side, Gafford back for Kyrie. Pull-up jumper from 17 as he let Moses slide by him. Kind of crossed him up a little bit. Nicely done. Hits the midi, and it's 6-2 Dallas. Left wing on the attack. Here comes Draymond missing the layup around P.J. Washington on the left alley drive, and it's P.J. the other way for Dallas. Driving right down Broadway off the glass, and it drops in over Trace Jackson Davis. Hit the back rim, backboard, and then fell in, and it's 8-2 Dallas. Two minutes gone by first quarter. In and out dribble with the left hand for Steph. Jumping into Gafford and drawing the foul. Two free throws coming up for Steph, who is helped up by Daniel Gafford. So Stephen Curry this year, 26.4 points per game, five assists, 93% from the foul line to lead the NBA. He has made 31 straight free throws. I said it last night, I'll say it again. At some point, he's going to make 100 straight free throws in his career. Will this be the streak that gets him there? He's got 69 more to go. Here's the first one from Steph. That's 32. Eight to three. Again, the NBA record is 97 consecutive makes. His god sister Cameron Brink made 73 straight free throws in a game for Stanford women's basketball this year. That was two off the NCAA women's basketball record. Cameron will likely be a top three pick in the WNBA draft this year. Both free throws good for stuff. He's made 33 in a row, and it's 8-4. Golden State trailing by four. Dante Exum, right baseline with it, working on Moody. Flings it left wing. Extra pass to DJJ Derek Jones Jr., and he traveled off the feed from P.J. Washington, the man they nicknamed Airplane Mode, shuffling the puppies there, who... Has told people he has a 47-inch vert. It was officially listed at 45 inches at the combine. Way back when in 2016. High on the right side, Draymond Green goes up top to Trace Jackson Davis. His pass for Moody stolen by Kyrie with Trace to beat. Lays it up and in. And a quick hook here from Steve Kerr. It's 10-4 Dallas with 9.34 to go. First quarter, a slow start for the Dubs on the road in Dallas. We'll take the break on the 95.7 The Game Warriors Radio Network presented by United Airlines. Whether on or off the court, the keys to success are the same. On the court, it's ball movement. Off the court, it's workflow. On the court, teams call plays to execute their game plan. Off the court, companies rely on systems to run their business smoothly. MRC Smart Technology Solutions, a Xerox company, is the official copier and office solutions provider of the Golden State Warriors. We offer large and small companies the technology they need to transform the way they work. Visit MRC360.com to learn more today. Warriors basketball on NBC Sports Bay Area. Join Bob Fitzgerald and Kalina Azabuki for all the action on the court. And tune in to Warriors pre- and post-game live hosted by Bonte Hill and former Warriors Chris Mullen and Festa Zazili for complete game day coverage one hour before and following every game. Plus, get your Warriors news all week long on the Dubs Talk podcast with Monty Poole and Dalton Johnson featuring special guests and in-depth analysis. Authentic moments live here, only on NBC Sports Bay Area. 15 years ago, PG&E launched Power Pathway, an education and job training program developed to increase the number of skilled workers in the energy industry. Since then, 85% of the graduates have been hired by PG&E or the construction utility industry, focusing on students in underserved communities, women, and military veterans. Power Pathway is helping the next generation of PG&E energy professionals build a better future for themselves and a clean energy future for California. To learn more, visit pge.com slash power pathway. One eight seven seven cars for kids. K A R S cars for kids. One eight seven seven cars for kids. Donate your car today. Donate your car today at carsforkids.org. Your car, running or not, can be picked up as soon as the next day. No title, no problem. Call eight seven seven cars for kids or go online at carsforkids.org to donate today. One eight seven seven cars for kids. K-A-R-S, Cars for Kids, 1877 cars for kids Donate your car today. Now accepting donations of land, homes, buildings, or any kind of real estate. Dub Nation, this is Chris Paul. You are listening to the Warriors Radio Network, presented by United Airlines. 
Thank you, CP3. Kevin Dana hanging out here in the DoorDash broadcast booth as the Warriors trailed the Mavericks 10-4. Kyrie Irving with six points and one assist has scored or assisted on eight of the ten Mavericks points to this point. Derek Jones Jr. tasked with the task of guarding Stephen Curry. Gives it off to Draymond Green. Here's Clay Thompson on a lob for Trace Jackson Davis. And the dunk for Trace makes it 10-6. Golden State trailing by four. Trace's first two of the ball game. Kyrie Irving across the timeline goes to the right wing for Dante Exum. Feeds a cutting Daniel Gafford who floats it up and in. Remember, he hit 33 straight shots from the field at one point this season. Was just shy of breaking an NBA record. Bounce pass to Moses Moody. Collects it at the right elbow. Bouncing it back to Draymond. Here's Jackson Davis on a dribble handoff on the left wing for Clay. Driving down Broadway around Exum. No. The follow for Trace. No. Second attempt. Uh-uh. Gets it back for a third time. Out to Moses. Back to Steph now just left of center with nine to shoot feeds a curling clay to the hoop off the glass with the left hand bonissimo over daniel gafford and it's 12 8 dallas leading by four 8 36 to go first quarter here comes Kyrie on the left wing a bounce pass to derrick jones jr for a quarter triple he's really improved the three but misses that one 35 percent from deep this year he was a mid-high 20s guy earlier in his career from beyond the arc draymond green nobody picks him up until he drives inside the foul line lays it up with the left hand yelled and lun but he missed the shot and didn't get the foul so it's 12-8, still Dallas with the basketball in the hands of Dante Exum. Marked by Moody on the right wing as he drives past Moses, recollects well, kicks it out to P.J. Washington for a left angle three. He knocks it down. Steve Kerr still not happy about something, perhaps that Draymond drive where he didn't get the whistle. 15-8, Dallas leading by seven. 7.57 to go first quarter. Step high on the right side, working on Derek Jones Jr. with a sauntering right hand handle, button? switching over to his Come left. On, just the beyond the right button. hash. Now 30-plus feet too. from the hoop Join as he drives family. past Derek Jones Jr., lays it off the glass and nothing else. Rebound Washington. Dallas in transition with Exum. Right baseline, back for Kyrie. Shot fake from three. Puts on the floor. Pull up from 14, off the glass. No good. Offensive rebound, Gafford. Has it in the short corner. Backing down on Trace. Kicks it out to Washington. Contested left angle three is good again. He was 5 of 8 from deep last night in their win over Atlanta. He's struggled from deep this year, 32%, but you have a feel a hot stretch is coming for P.J., and it's 18-8 Golden State down by 10. It's an 8-2 burst here for Dallas. Stephen Curry looking for contacts as he flips one up in the lane. No good, but Trace Jackson Davis has the follow in the Warriors' trail, 18-10, 7-08 to go first quarter. The Mavericks shooting 8 of 10 from the field, 80% to start. They won't shoot 80% for the entire game. Washington short on that left wing three. Trace the rebound. Gets it back to Draymond. Subs waiting to come in. Next dead ball both ways. Draymond to Clay. Puts it on the floor. Clay in the lane. Pulls up from 10. No. Offensive rebound. Trace knocked away by Gafford and collected by Washington along the baseline. Exum out in the front court now on the left wing with it. Working on Thompson. Bounces it back for a Washington left angle three. The third three. He's hit from that spot on the floor. And the Mavericks lead by 11. 21-10. And P.J. Washington has 11 points to lead everybody. He's 3 of 4 from deep. Steph gets the screen from Draymond. Looks for the pocket pass. It gets kicked by P.J. Washington. Three new Mavericks coming in. Jaden Hardy, Tim Hardaway Jr., and Dwight Powell all on for the Mavericks as Brandon Pajemski and Gary Payton the second come on for Golden State, replacing Moses Moody and Clay Thompson. In a shorter bench for Golden State tonight with Dario out, with Wiggins out. With Kaminga. Inbounds pass. GP2 gets it in to Trace on the right wing. Up top for Draymond. Looking around. Payton cutting back door. That was covered well by Kyrie on the lefty drive. Here comes Draymond. Floats it strong. And the rebound there for Dwight Powell. He's now 6 of 29 on shots from 8 to 16 feet this year, Draymond Green. One area where he has struggled offensively, though he's had a much better offensive season overall. Jaden Hardy on the fadeaway from 14, no good, just inside the left elbow. Here comes Draymond Green. Green, the lob to Trace Jackson Davis. He gets fouled as he was trying to put it in on Kyrie Irving. It's going to go that whistle. So that'll be his second personal foul. You get Kyrie in foul trouble, that wouldn't be a bad thing as Trace Jackson Davis goes to the line. He was 4 for 4 last night. On the season, 57% now. Entered last game at 55% from the foul line. He's 8th among rookies in rebounding, 2nd among rookies in field goal percentage. He misses the first free throw, 4th among rookies in blocks, 17th among rooks in scoring. 
You know, 7.8 points, 4.8 rebounds coming off a career high 20 piece against Houston last night. He hits the second. The Warriors trail by 10, 21 11, Dallas basketball. Jaden Hardy, second year NBA player, lofts it over to Dwight Powell, the Stanford Cardinal, hands it off to Kyrie Irving, who hits the three and gets fouled by Peyton. Wow, what a shot by Kyrie. He's kind of holding the right knee a little bit, but this guy is a magician with a rock in his hands. Yeah, it looked like they had called for the rip-through foul, which would be on the floor. And you know what? They did not count the basket. It was on the floor. Yeah, the fans don't like it, but that was a change to the rules uh, eight, nine years ago, maybe, where that's no longer in the act. And it is indeed still 21-11. Tim Hardaway Jr. will throw it in. Third leading score on Dallas this year. Just about 15 points per game. Tries to get it into Kyrie. It's knocked out of play by Peyton. So good foul, GP2. On the floor. And the Kyrie three, which will not count. And they wiped off the record books for eternity as he looks to throw it in right baseline. Right sideline, I should say, to Dwight Powell. Not a threat to shoot from three. He's one for two from downtown the entire season. Sets a screen. Does Dwight for Kyrie short on the three? Curry the rebound. Outletting for GP2. He soars to the rim and lays it in with the right hand. His offhand. And Golden State is within eight. 21-13 Mavericks in the hands of Tim Hardaway Jr. Big screen set by Dwight Powell and Stephen Curry. And Hardaway answers back with the left wing three. 24-13 Dallas by 11. Here's Steph up top with it. Patrolled by Powell on the cross match. Looking for the step back left wing three. It's short for Steph. Rebound knocked out of play. Last touch by Pajemski. 5-10 to go first quarter. A great start here for Dallas shooting 67% while Golden State is just 4 of 17 from the field. That's 24% and 0 for 3 from deep. Steph just two points from the foul line. No field goals made yet. Here's Hardy. Guarded by Steph. Left hand handle on the right wing. Surging to the 10. Kicks it out to the corner. Kyrie for Hardaway. Attacking off the catch and draws the foul on Pajemski on the floor. That'll be the second team foul on Golden State. So they still have a couple of fouls to give with 4.56 to go first quarter. Pods is first personal. An inbounds pass here for Tim Hardaway Jr. and friends. Of course, his pops played for Golden State, part of run TMC. Inbounds pass. Goes to Jaden Hardy. Has it left elbow. Just inside there as he defers to Kyrie. Has a left corner three in the air and good over Payton. Good contest, better offense. And Kyrie now has nine. Mavericks leading by two touchdowns. Cowboys up 27-13 on the Niners. Left wing, Curry to Draymond inside. Slips through the hands of GP2. Powell saves it in. Here comes Kyrie. Right wing three in the air. It's short. Oh, the roof was going to come off of this place if that went down. Steph the rebound and bring up for Golden State. Takes it over the right side. Draws two defenders. His hook pass is deflected and stolen. Run out for Hardaway. He lays it in 29-13. Another timeout called by Steve Kerr as this thing is getting ugly early for Golden State. 4-13 to go in the first. The Dubs trail the Mavericks by 16 on the 95-7 of the game. Warriors Radio Network presented by United Airlines. All right, listen up, team. We ain't quitters. We don't quit out on that field. We don't quit the game. And we don't quit on finding the right car. Because with CarMax's 30-day money-back guarantee, you have 30 days to love your car. But coach, we're eight. We don't need to know what CarMax's 30-day money-back guarantee is. Well, you gotta learn someday. 30-day money-back guarantee for the win, CarMax. Up to 1,500 miles. Visit CarMax.com for details. Warriors basketball on NBC Sports Bay Area. Join Bob Fitzgerald and Kalina Azabuki for all the action on the court. And tune in to Warriors pre- and post-game live hosted by Bonte Hill and former Warriors Chris Mullen and Festa Zazili for complete game day coverage one hour before and following every game. Plus, get your Warriors news all week long on the Dubs Talk podcast with Monty Poole and Dalton Johnson featuring special guests and in-depth analysis. Authentic moments live here, only on NBC Sports Bay Area. The roar of the crowd. 
The sweet sound of a swish. Nothing beats being there live at Shea Center for the game, Warriors fans. And Ticketmaster is your official gateway to buying and selling the best seats all season long. Ticketmaster verifies every seat sold, guaranteeing that getting into the game is a layup. Be there live to defend Warriors ground this season with seats from Ticketmaster.com slash Warriors. Ticketmaster, the official marketplace of the Golden State Warriors. I'm what you might call very good at hide and seek. This one time, my parents had to round up the whole neighborhood to track me down. It was a mess. A lot of tears. Well, now that we got Xfinity, we have Wi-Fi all over the house, including all my favorite super secret hiding spots. So I can kill time in here by streaming my shows and... Ha! Found ya. The heck? How? You left to find my tablet on. This generation... Ruining the game with their performance enhancers. Get wall to wall Wi Fi from Xfinity. Remember, everybody, for a reliable hit that like button, throughout hit that your subscribe home. button. Now through June 21st, sure you get vote. Gig Speed Who's Internet for $25 tonight? a month for know. two years with no annual contract and free Wi Fi equipment included when you add unlimited mobile. Go to Xfinity.com, call 1 800 Xfinity, or visit a store today. Requires paperless plan and auto pay with stored bank account. Restrictions apply. Taxes and fees extra. Gig Speed Wi Fi requires Gig Internet and Xfinity Gateway. Xfinity Mobile requires Xfinity Internet. After promo, regular rates apply to Internet Service and Wi-Fi equipment, actual speeds vary. Dub Nation, this is Chris Paul. You are listening to the Warriors Radio Network presented by United Airlines. Warriors trailing by 16, 413 to go in the first. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification. The radio home of the Golden State Warriors, KGMC FM and HD1 San Francisco on Odyssey Station. Warriors basketball out of the timeout. It's Dallas 29, Golden State 13. Mavs on an 8-0 run. Chris Paul into the game. Gets it back to Steph up top. Looney into the contest as well. Pajemski attacking from the right baseline. Down the lane. Into the corner for Moody. Nearly stolen. Gets it back to Pods. Guarded closely by Hardaway. Three to shoot. Pods on the drive. Spin move. Fade away. Off one foot in the land of Dirk Nowitzki. The one-footed fadeaway drops for Brandon Pajemski. It's 29-15. Looked a little different than the way Dirk did it. They got that statue of him here in Dallas. It's an awesome statue. Here's Hardaway through the hands of Powell and out of play. And it's the one-foot fadeaway that has been immortalized here for Dirk Nowitzki, who led the Mavericks to their only NBA title in 2011. They beat the Heatles in six games. Also led them, helped lead them to their other finals appearance in 2006 when they lost to the Heat in six games. And they were up 2 nothing and up 13 in game three with like five minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Sure, that still is a, a bad memory for some here in Dallas. Kevon Looney with it to the left wing for Brandon Pajemski. 29-15, Golden State down 14. Steph, catch and shoot straight on three. He's going to rattle in for Steph. Curry with his first made field goal. He's got five points. The Dubs have scored the last five. They trail 29-18. Now shooting 32% for the field as a team is Golden State. Jaden Hardy inside the right wing guard. No look pass to the left wing for Washington. Attacking from there. Euro stepping his way into a floater. No good. Rebound goes to Looney. Here comes Pods across the timeline. Skipping it opposite side of the floor for Steph. Just beyond the right hash. Gets the screen from Ball. Another one from Looney. Driving into the paint. Draws the foul on the floor, I believe they say. And it goes on Dwight Powell. Well, his first third team foul. Steph thought he was in the act. That will not be the case. He will go to the bench with 2.55 remaining first quarters. Clay checks in for him. Clay's one for four. Steph is one for four. Chris Paul will throw it in. He's yet to attempt a shot in his lone minute of PT to this point. He's got Paul on him. Feeds Clay. Lost it inside to a rolling Looney. Back to the basket, left block, hands it back for Clay. Back to Looney, left elbow jumper in the air and perfect. 7-0 run for Golden State. They trail 29-20. Kevon Looney with his first bucket of the game. Kyrie Irving across the timeline. He's got nine points and two assists. Looking for his third assist on the Hardaway corner three, which rattles out and lands on the lap of Pajemski. Outlet to Clay Thompson. Driving down the left alley. Lays it up and in. It's a 9-0 Golden State run. And Jay Kidd is going to have to call for time with 2.22 to go first quarter. We've paid our corporate overlords this quarter. We will keep it here as the Warriors only trail by seven. Stephen Curry with a three earlier saying that he knows the Warriors haven't quite reached their full potential yet this season. We're a proud group of guys that understand we are capable of winning. We've 
played way below our level, I think, for most of the year. But for us to be in this situation where we have an opportunity uh, to keep hope alive and, you know, see what happens in a, in a couple of weeks to try to get into a playoff series, like, just because we dug deep and, you know, this it matters to us. A 9-0 run here for Golden State to inch back within seven. It's been P.J. Washington leading the way for the Mavericks with 11 points, and this courtesy of the Rick Rubin of NBA Radio producing R.C. Davis. Over the last five games, uh, last six games for P.J. Washington, he's averaging 14.7 points on 44% three-pointing, also adding, adding seven rebounds and 1.2 steals per game. And in this game, 11 points on three of four three-pointing as that three-point percentage continues to tick north. It was in the high 20s at one point he's normally been a mid 30s three point shooter over the course of his five year NBA career 35% for the former lottery pick of the Charlotte Hornets 12th overall in 2019 he was traded to Dallas on the trade deadline two months ago along with a couple of second rounders for Seth Curry Grant Williams in a 2027 first round pick that's conditional as it's taken across the timeline by Kyrie Irving. Dallas basketball out of the T.O. with 2.12 to go first quarter. Drifts to the right wing, patrolled by Payton. Behind the back, bounce pass up top for Hardaway. Triple two strong. Kevon Looney has the rebound. Gets it over to Chris Paul. And here comes CP3 across the timeline. Gets the screen, draws two defenders, looks for Payton. Skip to pods, catch and shoot. Left wing, three. It's good. 29-25. And Golden State's on a 12-0 run. They've cut the deficit to four. Kyrie high on the right side. Both of these teams played last night. The Warriors won by 23 in Houston. The Mavs won the like right here by 14 on, over the ATL. The like it's 109.95. Crossover dribble. Kyrie to the open. The left hand. Oh, that would have been sweet if it went in. Instead, it's a loony rebound. It went off the back iron and right to Loon. Clay high on the left side. Dribbling for a straight on three. No good. Paul the rebound. No, knocked out of play by Kyrie. So it will stay with Golden State, 125 to go first quarter. Dallas 29, Golden State 25. It'll be a left baseline inbounds pass for Chris Paul. Paul looking around. Goes to Clay, dribbles inside the arc, pulls up from 17 left baseline. Jim and no good. Rebound on the weak side, corralled by Hardy. He'll bring it across the timeline. The former G League igniter with it. Surging pass, Paul drops it off. Gafford gets hacked by Kevon Looney and Daniel Gafford kind of holding his lower back afterwards. He will get to the line to shoot two free throws. And he's another big in-season acquisition. He started this season with the Washington Wizards. He was traded from Chicago to Washington March 25th of 2021, then traded February 8th for Rashawn Holmes and a least favorable first-round pick here in 2024. And he misses the first free throw. A 69% foul shooter. He's seventh in the league in blocks. He shoots 73% around the basket. League average is 60%. That's where 94% of his shot attempts come from. For the former Arkansas Razorback, did not play there alongside Moses Moody. Moody was there for the 2021 season. He was there from 2017 to 2019 was Daniel Gafford. So he goes 0 for 2 from the line. So a great foul by Kevon Looney. Just saved Golden State two points. It's Chris Paul with it high on the left side with a minute four remaining first quarter. Warriors still trailing by just four. Gets the screen from Payton on the pick and roll. It's GP2, the little big man with the lefty lay-in. It's a 14-0 run here for Golden State. Of course, the Mavericks had a 30-0 run in the fourth quarter against Oklahoma City earlier this year. In the fourth quarter, from down 24 to up six, Hardy on the left wing. Crossover dribble into the paint. Dishes out to Exxon. The 50% three-point shooter slides past Pajemski and lays it in with the left hand. Nicely done by the Aussie. 31-27 with 37 seconds to go. Prime two-for-one opportunity for CP3. Little fall away from the right side of the floor. Knocks it down. The mid-range master, Chris Paul, makes it 31-29. Golden State back within a deuce and a 9-10 to 10 second differential between the two clocks. That was perfectly done by CP3. Exum high on the left side to Gafford. Off for Tim Hardaway Jr. Dribbling to the left elbow. Halts the handle. Nearly picked by Paul. Looney almost had it, and it's off Hardaway. It will go to Golden State. Shot clock off with 16.8. They could potentially have the lead going into the second quarter after they got down by 16 points here in the first. Wow. Quite the turn of events here in the Big D. 
Across the timeline will come Chris Paul with a nine seconds left here in the first quarter. Opposed by Axum. A screen from Loon. Looking left. Switched onto by Gafford with three seconds. Paul fading away to beat the buzzer from the left wing. Yes, sir. He might have walked to get into that three, but we won't tell anybody. It's 32-31. Golden State has the lead, ending the quarter on a 19-2 run. We'll take the break. Come on back with the start of the second on the 95-7 The Game Warriors Radio Network, presented by United Airlines. For Golden State Warriors game days, DoorDash is your triple threat. Bringing the food, drinks, and supplies right when you need it. The one who delivers the energy boost at halftime gives your watch party that spark. Right off the bench is second three of the night. The playmaker and the daymaker. When the Warriors need you most, that's when you need DoorDash. Call in the sixth man. DoorDash, official partner of the Golden State Warriors. What's up, Dove Nation? It's Stephen Curry. I love the sound of the Warriors crowd, so I've asked for them to help with this Rakuten commercial, the app that gives you cash back at thousands of stores. Plus, fans can score 10% cash back with Rakuten on Warriors gear, either in arena or online at Rakuten.com backslash Warriors. Just join Rakuten to get your ching on all your favorite Dove's things. All right, now that's a little too much. Visit Rakuten.com backslash Warriors. It's Friday, and this is Johnny Mosley with your Toyota Tahoe Report. The weather can't quite make up its mind today, but hey, it's going to be a great weekend. Make sure you pack a couple extra layers and head on up here in your Toyota. Thanks, Johnny. Scattered showers continue as the low pressure drifts south with lighter winds today. An additional 2 to 5 inches at the base, 3 to 7 inches near mid-mountain, and 5 to 9 inches up top. Highs drop in the upper 20s. This report has been brought to you by your local Toyota dealers. Toyota, let's go places. My garage is stacked to the rafters. We make junk disappear. All you have to do is point. Is this going to cost a lot? The average garage clean-out is just $197. $197? No, no, no. I've got way more junk than that. Our trucks can haul off seven times as much as a pickup truck. If your garage fills up our entire truck, it could be as much as $497. Come and make this junk disappear. All you have to do is point. Call 1-800-GOT-JUNK. Or visit 1-800-GOT-JUNK.com. This is Clay Thompson. You are listening to the Warriors Radio Network, presented by United Airlines. Well, the Warriors lead 32-31 as we start the second quarter, and the Warriors are teaming up with Kaiser Permanente in the athletes' corner to turn points into meals with swishes for dishes. For each point the Warriors score this season, 100 meals will be donated to Bay Area families in need. Visit warriors.com slash swish to learn more. Warriors basketball to start the second, leading 32-31 on the Mavericks. Clay whips a pass to the right side of the floor for Moses Moody. Back over to the left side for Pajemski. Working there on Hardaway. Up top, it's Paul with it. Driving on Exum into the paint. Bounce pass for Looney. Power dribble on Gafford. Has it swatted. It goes right to Pajemski. Challenging Gafford and floats it up and in with two on the timeout. 34-31. It's a 21-2 Golden State run now. Their largest lead of the game is right now. Daniel Gafford up top. Deferring to Hardaway. Corralled by Clay. Back to Gafford on the left wing. Hardaway now. Carving inside. Flings a pass with his left hand. A nice feed to Exum for a corner three. He's now 50 of 99 on threes this season. Just above 50%. 50 made. 49 missed. High on the right side. Chris Paul. Crossover dribble. And the two for one to perfection to end the quarter. As he kicks it into the corner. Escape dribble. Triple in and out from Moody. As the rebound goes to Gafford. A.J. Lawson onto the floor for the first time for Dallas. Here's Dallas off in the lane, and Gafford is there, and he rolls it home. Yeah, tough shot right there. Caught it, kept it high. Nice little soft touch. The Mavericks go in front, 36-34. Back-to-back baskets after Golden State, a 21-2 run. Paul against Exum at the midcourt line. Now into the jump circle, faking left and turning right. The screen by Looney will look like he traveled, got away with it as he passed to Pajimski. Running hook shot way short. The rebound. Exum pushed out of bounds. He'll, the Mavericks will have the ball, but no foul call against Looney. They're like a play. And he put a two-hander right into Exum's back. And Steve Kerr wants this one reviewed, thinking that Exum may have touched that last. So we'll take the timeout with 10-22 remaining in the first half. The Mavericks 36, the Warriors 34 on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. 
Great medical care, like great basketball, takes teamwork and a commitment to being the very best. At UT Southwestern Medical Center, we're on a mission of healing, discovery, and education, and the ultimate victory is your good health. Fulfilling that mission has made UT Southwestern the number one hospital in DFW for seven straight years, an excellent winning streak. Finding answers, changing lives. UT Southwestern, the official health care partner of the Dallas Mavericks. Go Mavs! After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice cold reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know, the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours, the energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter, and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. Panini, the exclusive trading card and sticker partner of the NBA, is the home for your favorite Dallas Mavericks collectibles. From trading cards to signed memorabilia, Panini is the place to collect your favorite Mavs players. From high-flying dunks to amazing triple-doubles, go to Panini Instant to get the hottest player highlight cards fresh off the presses. Don't miss out on all the rookie moments to veteran performances. Go to iCollectPanini.com. Who do you collect? At Comerica Bank, we believe every business should have equal access to opportunities and resources. That's why we created Comerica Co-Work Spaces, free for any Comerica small business customer. Book an office, access tech, use a meeting room, network with other business owners, and more, all for free. To learn more about how Comerica supports all small businesses, visit Comerica.com slash spaces. Member FDIC, equal opportunity lender. Comerica Co-Work Spaces is available to Comerica customers only. You know what In-N-Out hamburgers are all about. But what about our fries? It's pretty simple. It all begins with the finest, freshest potatoes, hand-cut right in the store, then cooked to perfection in 100% sunflower oil and served piping hot. Now that's a side order worth singing about. Your home for Dallas Mavericks basketball. 97-1, The Freak. Summer camp experience with hoop, dance, and gaming camps with a variety of dates and DFW locations to choose from. There's no better way to start your kids' summer. Visit Mavs.com slash academy today. Golden State retains the ball as it was ruled that that ball was last touched by Dante Exum with 3.8 to shoot as Chris Paul looking to get it into Thompson in the right corner between two to Moody down low, and they find Paul. That's no good. Rebound to a green and he tried to tip it out to Pajimski who could not make the save and it'll be Dallas ball but I'm still trying to figure out Brad how that was Golden State's ball if for no other reason that Kevon Looney pushed Dante Exum out of bounds and touched the ball well, they're gonna say he touched him when he was out of bounds that was a big key and Pajemski going into the front row knocks over some Liquid. Did you hit so the like button? To be cleaned Come up. on, hit the Your like button. Fans, and uh, subscribe the too. Join the family. Where the Warriors are shooting as we see the floor. The Mavericks with Exum, Hardaway, A.J. Lawson, Daniel Gafford, and Derek Jones. So A.J. Lawson, who has obviously not played very much, getting some really important minutes. Here at the start of the second quarter. And as they still try to clean everything up along the sideline right where Lawson is inbounding the ball and he'll drop it in and Tim Hardaway will bring it up. Maverick shooting to our right as Hardaway met by Pachimski. The handoff to Exum. Lawson cuts back door. Exum keeps the dribble. Drives on Thompson. The cutting Gafford off his hands and taken by Paul. Here comes CP3 through the traffic and now holds up at the top of the arc. To Thompson, a whistle, offensive foul against Golden State. Draymond Green called for the illegal screen, trying to free up Clay Thompson. Fourth, Warriors turnover. Mavericks 36, Warriors 34. Just over two minutes gone here in the second quarter. As Exum comes up the left side for the Mavericks. And across the floor to the right. Watched by Paul, curling his heart away behind him. He'll take the three. He cannot get the roll. The rebound along the baseline. And a whistle. And 
was out of bounds. Out of bounds. AJ Lawson was out of bounds trying to grab that rebound, and it'll be Golden State's ball. And Kyrie Irving will come back in the game to replace Derek Jones. Golden State a 17 to 11 lead on the boards already. And again, where the Mavericks miss Derek Lively the most has been in trying to keep the rebounding in check. Golden State out rebounding the Mavericks 54 42 on Tuesday. 21 games Lively has missed. Mavericks been out rebounding in 15 of them. Here's Pajemski from the left wing. Euro stepping to his left. A lot of contact as Lawson tried to take the charge. And Pajemski able to get the roll. Yeah. Took the hit and still finished. Tied at 36. And now Pajemski a foul deep along the right side as Exum was trying to go that way. That's two on Brandon Pajemski. As Gary Payton comes back in for Golden State to replace Moody. Tied at 36. 9.24 remaining in the first half. Kyrie looking to inbound the ball. And finally into Hardaway, right of the jump circle. Gafford comes up and catches top of the arc against Draymond Green. Two bounces to his right. Finds Exum in the corner along the baseline. Nice skidding wraparound. Lawson left corner three, rims out. Rebound off the hands of Exum, taken by Thompson to Golden State. Here comes Paul to Thompson, and he stepped out of bounds when he caught the pass. Thompson not realizing where he was on the floor as P.J. Washington comes back in for the Mavericks. And Gafford will sit down. Well, again, everybody... The small lineups. Yeah, the, the Draymond's at the five for Golden State. P.J. Washington going to play the five for the Mavericks. As Exum, middle of the floor. Kyrie screens. Exum turned back by Payton. Now tries to attack him to his right. 14 to shoot. Thompson overplaying Kyrie, but Kyrie got it to his left. Pull up three. It's short. And Pajemski with a rebound, his third. Here comes Paul up the middle. Watched by Lawson, left to Pajemski. Deeper left side off the lane. Draymond scoops it to Thompson. Put it on the floor. Drop it to Green. Low post left against Washington. Seven to shoot. On the roll. Got the step on him. Laid it up and in. Pretty move. First points for Draymond Green. Golden State leads at 38-36. Irving between his legs right to left at the foul line swing it back right to Lawson Lawson will drive on Paul through the lane left to Hardaway against Pajemski protects the ball got to the rim and laid it up and in as he turned the corner Yep, got the angle on him Game tied at 38 8 10 remaining first half Thompson left to right to Paul in the middle of the floor To his right off green Washington switches on to Paul crossing over left to right Behind into Pajemski against Lawson, six to shoot. He drive, turns the corner, double pump, missed the layup. The rebound off the hands of Exum, picked up by Washington to Kyrie, met at half court by Paul. And on the run, here comes Lawson, shot blocked from behind by Peyton, taken down by Paul. To Pajemski on the drive, laid off to the cutting. Thompson laid it up and in, and not a lot that Kyrie could do there. Didn't want to pick up the third foul. Yeah, it all started with the defensive end for Golden State. Great block by Peyton, 40 to 38. Golden State by two, four and a half gone. Here in the second quarter, Irving turns to his left arm. Pajemski at the elbow, met by Paul. Went through them both, and he hits the little runner from below the dotted line. It's 11 for Irving. Tied at 40. 7.15 remaining in the half. Paul at the top of the arc against Lawson. And at the top of the circle, pulls up and hits. I tell you what, he has just killed the Mavericks for 19 years, and he's doing it again tonight. Killed a lot of people for 19 years. Yeah. Scores his second most points per game against the Mavericks. The most he scores is against Golden State. And Pajemski stepping out on the double team. Going to be called for a foul. And that's going to be three on Brandon Pajemski. As Hardy and Jones come back in for the Mavericks. Hardaway and Lawson sit down. And Steph Curry comes back in the game for Golden State. Pajemski. Getting a word from Steve Kerr as the Mavericks will inbound from just over the midcourt line on the right. As Exum looks into Washington, looking for Kyrie, short hop at the right wing, and drawing the foul on the rip through against Gary Payton. It's two on Gary Payton, and the 13 foul against Golden State. And Kyrie will inbound from the 
Right sideline, foul line extended. Looking, Washington cuts to the basket, can't get it to him. Out to Jaden Hardy, who's checked back in against Curry. To his right off of Kyrie, now against Peyton. Against Curry comes Kyrie, stop and go, got by him. Tried to throw it through the lane, knocked away by Paul. As he played the passing lane, Green picks it up on the drive, right to left to Curry, to the top to Moody. And to the right to Chris Paul, watched by Kyrie, down low, right block to Green, to the cutting Curry, that's off his hands, out of bounds, and it'll be Dallas ball. The sixth Golden State turtle, their third here on the second. Almost to the midway point with the Warriors up 42-40. Exum right to left. Turned back by Moody. To the top to Washington. Takes the three. Knocks down the three. Yeah, they lost track of him. A 14-point first half for P.J. Washington, including four of five from three. And the Mavericks in front, 43-42. And here's a pass down low by Green off the hands of Paul. Picked up by Kyrie. Ahead to Washington. In the lane. At the charge circle. Missed it. Tipped out by Jones. Controlled by Paul. Here comes Paul. Four on three. Top of the arc. And from behind, Washington blocked the shot. Into the hands of Exum. Here comes Exum with Peyton reaching in. Veers off to his left. Cuts to his right. Spins left on Moody. Moody knocked it away from behind and Moody will come out of the traffic with it away from Washington up the right side to the trailing green at the top of the arc against Derek Jones left hand push Curry catch and shoot three wide open hit it I got a nice screen down by Golden State in front 45 43 5 10 remaining in the half Hardy against Paul right to left stop and go Got stripped by Paul, loose on the floor, picked up by Jones, right to Exum for three off the left of the rim. And the rebound taken by Moody and rips it away from Hardy. Here comes Curry up the left side. Against Exum, just over the midcourt line. Screen by Peyton, the switch by Kyrie. Behind his back, left to right. Curry on the drive. Right corner, Green takes the three. That's no good. Rebound out of bounds. And last touch by Peyton. It'll be Mavericks ball as Daniel Gafford will come back in for the Mavericks. And Exum will sit down. Chris Paul sits down. And Draymond Green, too, is Pajimski. And Thompson come back, or Trace Jackson Davis, excuse me, come back in the game for Golden State. Up the left side comes Jones. At the hash mark, watched by Pajimski, playing with three fouls. Picks up the dribble. Kyrie covered. They find Gafford. Jones cut back door. Gafford couldn't get it to him. Backwards dangerously, but it came to Irving. To the right to Hardy. Catch and shoot three is good. Jaden Hardy confidently stepping into that one to put the Mavericks in front, 46-45, with 4-10 remaining in the half. The Mavericks 8 of 18 from three. Curry stepping back, left wing, away from Jones. It's no good. Gafford, the rebound is seven. To Hardy, cross court left to Kyrie, in and out to his right, and a backhand pass finds Gafford in the lane, lays it up and in, a tremendous pass by Kyrie. Yeah, nice find that time. I don't know how I found him in traffic. Mavericks up by three, 48-45. Curry along the right side, left hand push to Jackson Davis. Did you hit the like button? To the Come on, hit the like button. Left to subscribe right. too. To Join the family. Plays it off. Jackson Davis fouled by Hardy going up. Good foul there though. Make him earn it. First one for Jaden Hardy. First foul on the Mavericks here in the second quarter, with 3:34 remaining. And Jason Kidd going to challenge this. I don't think he will. Fans looking at the replay, thinking that Hardy got a lot of the ball. But no challenge. Jackson Davis to shoot. First one is good. A 20-point game last night in Houston. A season high for him as Tim Hardaway comes back in to replace Jaden Hardy for the Mavericks. And one more coming for the rookie out of Indiana. His dad, a heck of an NBA player, is the second one no good. Gafford grabs the rebound. Dale Davis was one tough hombre. 16 years in the NBA, nine of them in Indiana. As part of a bunch of teams that went to the Eastern Conference Finals. Here is Irving in the lane. Left corner, Derek Jones, catch and shoot three, got it. Nice find by Kyrie. Yeah, all about the penetration, driving kick. The Mavericks 51, the Warriors 46. 
And the Mavericks right now in an 8-1 to one run as we come down on three minutes remaining in the first half. Pajimski to the right to Curry with Jones right there. Turns off him, cuts to his left on the drive, and way up in the air and threw it over the backboard as Gafford, again, a terrific job challenging that shot. Yep, just goes straight up. Curry's in there looking for contact, not getting it. And before the Mavericks inbound, the Mavericks will take a timeout, and they'll do so with 2.57 remaining in the first half. The Mavericks 51, the Warriors 46 on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice-cold reward. Medela is the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know, the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours, the energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter. and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. Great medical care, like great basketball, takes teamwork and a commitment to being the very best. At UT Southwestern Medical Center, we're on a mission of healing, discovery, and education, and the ultimate victory is your good health. Fulfilling that mission has made UT Southwestern the number one hospital in DFW for seven straight years, an excellent winning streak. Finding answers, changing lives. UT Southwestern, the official health care partner of the Dallas Mavericks. Go Mavs! Texas, the stampede is running, but it's about to run out. It's the final days of truck month at your Texas Ford dealer. Hurry in for a stampede of savings on Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks 47 years straight. Experience the power and capability of Ford Super Duty and Ford F-150. Come join the stampede today and get the best deals on a new Ford truck, official truck of the Dallas Cowboys. Based on 1977 to 2023 total sales. Hey, Dallas Mavericks fans, have you heard? America's number one lottery app is Jackpocket. Now you can order your Powerball, Mega Millions, and Lotto Texas tickets right on your phone. No stopping, no lines. Plus, download the Jackpocket app now and use code DUNK at checkout for a free lottery ticket when you download America's number one lottery app, Jackpocket. Again, that's code DUNK for a free lottery ticket. Jackpocket is an official partner of the Dallas Mavericks. Number one app claim based according to data from AppFollow. Now back to Dallas Mavericks basketball. On 97.1 The Freak. I'm Kevin Gray here at the Modelo Sports Desk to get you caught up on two important scores involving the Dallas Mavericks in the Western Conference standings. Pelicans is tied at 78-75. Excuse me, Pelicans up by three over the San Antonio Spurs with 504 left in the third quarter. Meanwhile, the Celtics are up 98-80 to over the Sacramento Kings with 522 left in the fourth quarter as, of course, the Mavericks holding the tiebreaker over the Pelicans and the Sacramento Kings currently in the Western Conference stand. Let's go back to Chuck Cooperstein. Want to start your own companies and businesses? Mark Cuban's recommended free LLC plus state fees. They've got the tools you need to start, run, and grow your dream business. Turn your dream into reality at zenbusiness.com. The Mavericks on an 8 to 1 right now with a 51 46 lead, 257 remaining in the first half. And this is the largest lead for either team, Brad, here in the second quarter. Yeah, I mean, the Golden State made that run at the end of the first quarter. And tell you here in a second. Kyrie brings it up. Mavericks shoot to our right. Bounces to Washington. And then he threw it away. The steal by Jackson Davis. Chris Paul through the traffic against Washington now. Outside the arc, right of the circle to his left. Switched on to by Gafford. Gives it up to Thompson at the right hash mark against Kyrie. Jackson Davis cross screen to his left. Take and roll with Jackson Davis in the lane against Gafford. Missed the layup. Gafford the rebound. Nine rebounds for Gafford here in the first half. To Washington up the right side. To the rim for Gafford. And he was underneath the basket. Not in a position to score. Green knocked it away. Picked up by Thompson. Now to Jackson to uh, Paul. Across the way to Curry. Quick release three from the left is perfect. He doesn't need any time to get that off. Steph Curry's third three. He's got 11. It's 51-49 as we come down on two minutes to play in the half. Irving along the left wing against Thompson. Bounce pass right to Jones. Fake right and go left. And a whistle. And a defensive three-second call against Draymond Green of the Warriors. That'll put Kyrie Irving on the line to shoot a technical. With a minute 57 remaining. Mavericks trying to make it 13 out of 15. Trying to snap the Warriors' six-game winning streak, which is the 
longest active winning streak in the NBA. Free throw from Kyrie is good. A 12-point half for him. Washington leads the Mavericks with 14. And the Mavericks will inbound from the left side with Hardaway to inbound to Washington against Chris Paul. Kyrie comes around, play by Paul, back, left, Hardaway, three, hit the front rim. And the rebound to Jackson Davis. Hardaway now one of five from three, three of seven overall. Here is Curry between his legs, knocked away by Washington, retrieved at the midcourt line. Curry on the move, left-hand wraparound pass, and coming up from right to left, Jackson Davis missed the layup. Jones with the rebound. Here comes Jones on the drive around Curry. He'll float it up, and that's no good. The rebound and a loose ball foul on Gafford as Gafford knocked Raymond Green to the ground. The first in the last two minutes against the Mavericks. Two on Gafford, two on Irving. Most of the fouls for the Mavericks. Again, not many free throws shot. Just three for the Mavericks here in the first half. And uh, one of those was the technical a moment ago from Kyrie. Golden State six of nine from the line in the half. Draymond Green brings it up to his right against Irving. Cross court, Jackson Davis laid off to Curry, left to right, into the lane, through the lane, out to Green, back to Curry. Quick release three, and that's an air ball. Tipped out by Gafford, but controlled by Thompson. To the left, Paul, and a whistle, and Paul stepped out of bounds. Well, that's a couple of times here, Brad, that uh, there's not been very good awareness for Golden State of where they are on the floor. Came up on the sideline, stepped on it. The eighth Golden State turtle. A minute to play in the half. The Mavericks 52, the Warriors 49. Kyrie walks it up. They're going to try to trap him in the middle of the floor. Bounce pass left to Jones. Played by Green on the switch. Wrap around left Washington against Curry through the traffic. And he had it ripped out of his hands by Jackson Davis to Curry. Left to Thompson for three to tie the game at 52. 40 seconds remaining in the half. That's a ninth turnover for the Mavericks. And 14 points for Golden State off the mistakes. Hardaway, deep right side. Rise and fire for three. That's way off. And the rebound to Jackson Davis. Eight rebounds for the rookie out of Indiana, Trace Jackson Davis. Mavericks were playing two for one there. Seven second difference. Shot clock to game clock. Chris Paul just over the line on the left, pounding it. Directing traffic, eight to shoot. Here comes the screen from Jackson Davis. Paul to his right against Gafford on the switch. Picks up the dribble, looking to the rim for Jackson Davis. Got behind Washington to lay it up and in. Nice five by Paul. Good backdoor cut. Final six seconds of the half. Hardaway with four and three and deep. And that shot's blocked by Green. Taken down by Paul, and that'll do it for the first half. And Golden State will take a two-point lead to halftime after they trail by 16 early in the game trail by five at 51 46 with just under three minutes remaining in the first half and uh, they go on an eight to one run to end the half after the mavericks went on an eight to one run of their own and one thing brad looking at the the score sheet again the bench scoring situation is a real problem for the mavericks that they've been outscored badly uh, in the first two games uh, since Derek Lively went out of the lineup and uh, it was uh, noticeable on Tuesday for sure it was a 39 to 13 in favor of Golden State 22 to 10 here in the first half tonight yeah Golden State's bench got him back into that game after they went down 16 yeah Chris Paul just a fabulous half seven points two rebounds four assists and four steals in 15 minutes of play. Pretty fair backup point guard to have playing for you. Yeah, solid. The Warriors shoot 44%, 21 of 48, 6 of 15 from three. The Mavericks 48.8%, 9 of 22 from three. But again, not getting to the free throw line. Just 53 free throws for the Mavericks in their last 18 quarters of basketball. Led by 14 from P.J. Washington and 12 for Kyrie Irving. Curry, the double-figure score for Golden State. He's got 11. Halftime here at the American Airlines Center. The Warriors 54, the Mavericks 52. Kevin Gray at the Modelo Sports Desk with highlights of the first half and the rest of the day and night in the NBA. Coming your way next on the Dallas Mavericks Radio Network. 
Whataburger now has new premium coffee with a brand new taste. And it's coming in hot and iced cold. Drink it hot with a biscuit sandwich or iced with a brownie. Or iced with a biscuit sandwich and hot with a brownie. This is your chance to mix it up a little. Let your hair down. There's no wrong way to drink it. New hot and iced coffee from Whataburger. Just like you like it. TXU Energy is changing the game with Live Your Free, the first and only plan of its kind that automatically adapts each month to give you free energy when you use it most. What if I use the most during the day? Enjoy free energy all day, every day. What if I suddenly become a night owl? Your nights are free automatically. What if I go weekend warrior? Free energy all weekend, my friend. So the savings change with me. And you never have to change a thing. TXU Energy. Energy for everything. Free energy charges and time periods to find in plan EFL. TDU and other bill charges apply normally. Visit TXU.com for details. After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice cold reward. Medela is the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours. The energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter, and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. Fly to Philly, take off to Tampa, depart for Denver. Following your team on the road is more rewarding with the new American Airlines Advantage program. Your flights and everyday spend not only earn you miles toward your next trip, but also loyalty points toward Advantage status. All the more reason to purchase both a home and a away jersey. With status comes great benefits like priority boarding, free check bags, and complimentary upgrades. Not a member? Enroll for free today at AA.com. American Airlines, you are why we fly. Terms and conditions apply. Great medical care, like great basketball, takes teamwork and a commitment to being the very best. At UT Southwestern Medical Center, we're on a mission of healing, discovery, and education, and the ultimate victory is your good health. Fulfilling that mission has made UT Southwestern the number one hospital in DFW for seven straight years, an excellent winning streak. Finding answers, changing lives. UT Southwestern, the official health care partner of the Dallas Mavericks. Go Mavs! Mav Maniacs, have you tried HTO yet? HTO is now available at all Mavs home games. We have over 26 flavors of the best sweet and unsweet iced tea. Don't have a favorite yet? No problem. You can come in and sample them all. We also sell our premium water, crunchy ice, snacks, and have a full line of Yeti, Hydro Flask, and Pelican products to help keep it all cold. Grab some HTO at the AAC or stop by and see us at one of our dozen DFW locations today. Hey, it's Mark Cuban. You better be listening to the home of the Dallas Mavericks, 97.1 The Freak. Time now for the Halftime Show on the Mavericks Radio Network. Now, here's your host, Kevin Gray. Competitive and entertaining first half from the American Airlines Center between your Mavericks and the Golden State Warriors. Mavericks down by two, 54 to 52 at halftime as the Warriors close the final two minutes of the second quarter on an 8-1 run to take the lead going into halftime. Mavs shot 48% from the field and 41% from three as P.J. Washington had 14 points to lead the Mavs. Kyrie Irving was the other Maverick in double figures with 12 points. Warriors shot 40% from three and 44% overall from the field as it got 11 points from Stephen Curry and seven points from Chris Paul, who was a plus 25 in the first half. Let's get you caught up on the first half highlights from the AAC. Mavericks without Luka Doncic tonight started the game on a 10-4 run as they led by six in the first two and a half minutes of the game as Kyrie Irving scored six of the Mavericks' first 10 points. Kyrie Irving getting the steal on one end and then going coast to coast on the other end for the layup. The Mavericks need to be able to take care of it. And there's a steal by Kyrie on a cross-court pass to the rim, hanging and scoring as he got inside of Trace Jackson Davis. And Mavs started the game 7 of 8 from the field after a P.J. Washington three, three-pointer had the Mavs up 15 eight, with 8 minutes left. In the first quarter, the Mavericks eventually pushed the lead to 11 at 21 to 10 with six and a half minutes left in the period. P.J. Washington getting to the act, knocking down a couple of three pointers. The first one getting the Mavs up by 10. Brings it back out to the middle of the lane. Left to Washington. Rise and fire for three. He hits. Mavs up 18 to 8 with seven and a half minutes left in the first. And Washington knocks down his third three pointer of the first quarter, this time on the left wing to increase the Mavericks lead to 11. Ahead to Exum, up the left side. Exum met by Thompson. Behind him to Washington. He's feeling it. He got it again. 
Maswell on an 8-0 run to increase their lead to 16 at 29-13 to after they were up by 8 with 5.5 minutes left in the quarter. The Warriors were down by 16 but responded with a 9-0 run to pull within 7 at 29-22 to with 2 minutes left in the second quarter. Eventually, it got up to what was a 14-0 run as the Warriors cut the Mavericks lead to 2 at 29-27. to Dante Exum, though, would end at that 14-0 run with this bucket here. Golden State's 4 of 17, 0 of 3 from 3. Hardy to his left, met by Pajemski. Behind them to Irving against Peyton. Rise and fire, 3, hit it! That Kyrie Irving three-pointer had the Mavs up by 14 at 27 to 13 with four and a half minutes left in the first. Then Dante Exum gets the layup to end the Warriors' 14-0 run. Against Looney on the switch, trying to tack him left to right. Lays it off, right wing. Exum try to drive to turn the corner, laid it up and in. Warriors, though, would close the first quarter on a 19-2 run over the final four minutes and 14 seconds of the first quarter after a Chris Paul buzzer beater from three to give the Warriors a 32-31 lead at the end of one. P.J. Washington had 11 points in the first quarter. On to the second quarter. Mavs down by one to begin the period. Back and forth starting the first five minutes of the quarter as the Warriors outscored the Mavs 10-9 to to maintain a 42-40 lead after a Chris Paul jumper as both teams started 50% from the field in the first five minutes of the period. Dante Exum knocking down a three-pointer in the right corner to tie the game at 34. A.J. lost in the game to start the second quarter. Cuts back door, doesn't get the pass. Hardaway, left to right. Exum, right corner three. Hits to tie the game at 34. That came with just under 11 and a half minutes left in the second quarter. Mavs were down 45-43 with four and a half minutes left in the second quarter, but went on an 8-1 run to take a five-point lead with three minutes left after a Derrick Jones Jr. three-pointer. P.J. Washington continues his hot shooting from three, knocks down his four three-pointer of the game to get the Mavericks up by one. Exum right to left, turned back by Moody to the top to Washington, takes the three, knocks down the three. Jaden Hardy then would knock down a three-pointer of his own on the right wing to give the Mavs the 46-45 lead back. Backwards dangerously, but it came to Irving to the right to Hardy, catch and shoot three is good. That came with 417 left in the second quarter, but the Warriors would close the second quarter on an 8-1 run over the final two minutes and 21 seconds of the period to take a 54-52 lead into halftime. Mavs shot 40% from the field and 36% from three as they got four points from Daniel Gafford. Warriors shot 43% from the field and 37.5% from three as they got six points from Stephen Curry as he led them at 54-52 at halftime. Now let's check out the Lexus NBA scoreboard with 11 other games tonight. In a busy night in the association on this Friday night, we start with a couple of games that have already gone final. The Portland Trailblazers get the 108-102 win over the Wizards. Pacers get the 126-112 win at home over the Thunder. Hornets 124-115 over the Orlando Magic. And the Celtics hang on for the one-point win, 101-100 over the Sacramento Kings as the Mavericks with a win tonight would increase their game's lead over the Sacramento Kings. Meanwhile, the New Orleans Pelicans and San Antonio Spurs tied at 88 with 9.45 left in the fourth quarter. Raptors up 85-74 over the Milwaukee Bucks on the road. Grizzlies up by 19, 89 to 70 at the end of three over the Detroit Pistons and the Heat are up 93 to 83 over the Rockets on the road. Bulls up 74, 68 at home over the New York Knicks. Still to come tonight, you'll have the Minnesota Timberwolves visiting the Phoenix Suns and the Utah Jazz visiting the Los Angeles Clippers. In other sports news of the day, USC freshman Bronny James has declared for the 2024 NBA draft and entered the transport portal to keep his options open. And South Carolina defeats North Carolina State tonight to advance to the national championship, the women's national championship, as Don Staley and the South Carolina Gamecocks remain undefeated on the season. And that's a look at your other sports news of the day. The Mavericks down by two at halftime, 54-52 to 52 looking to snap. The Golden State Warriors' six-game winning streak got some work to do at the AAC. Coming up next, we'll take it back out live to the American Airlines Center in Dallas for the second half with the voice of the Mavericks, Chuck Cooperstein and Brad Davis on the Dallas Mavericks Radio Network.
Rowdy, proud, and late? Forget searching for a parking spot. Ride Dart Rail or the TRE directly to the AAC at Victory Station instead. Catch tip-off from your seat, not the parking lot. Train service fast and right to the arena with Dart. Oh, yeah, now you're thinking. There are a lot of ways to make whiskey, but there's only one way to make Jack Daniels. Jack could have been like any other whiskey. Instead, we charcoal mellow every drop through 10 feet of hard sugar maple charcoal. We use water from Cave Spring Hollow in Lynchburg, Tennessee. It's no coincidence that Jack is what it is today. Because when you make your own label, you make everything else yours too. But we don't need to tell you that, do we? Make it count. Jack Daniels. Please drink responsibly. Tennessee Whiskey, 40% alcohol by volume. Jack Daniels Distillery, Lynchburg, Tennessee. Jack Daniels, an old number seven registered trademark. 2022 Jack Daniels, all rights reserved. No one's a bigger Mavs fan than me. I've got the <gasps> Jersey Jammies, Joggers, Shower Curtain, Bath Mat, Bubble Bath, Coasters, Car Coasters, Screen Saver, Lock Screen, Phone Case, Yard Flag, Car Flags, License Plate Cover, Grill Cover, Car Cover. <sighs> But nothing compares to my official Mavs toll tag. I can show off my team and cut my toll bill in half. Found mine at GetMyTollTag.com. Oh, and get this, it's only $19.99. Real Mavs fans know what's up. Small sticker, big savings. Jefferson Dental and Orthodontics is the official dentist of the Dallas Mavericks and has been trusted for affordable, high-quality dental and orthodontic care since 1967. Your smile is their priority, and they're offering Mavs fans a special deal. For a limited time, you can start Invisalign for as low as $99 down and $74 a month. Text MAVS to 91088 or visit jeffersondentalclinics.com slash MAVS to get this deal. Messaging data rates and terms apply. Hey, Mavs fans, dunk on traffic by taking DART to the AAC. Enjoy fast, reliable, convenient DART rail or TRE service directly to the arena when you hop off at Victory Station. Train service fast and right to the arena with DART. Oh, yeah, now you're winning. You know what In-N-Out hamburgers are all about. But what about our fries? It's pretty simple. It all begins with the finest, freshest potatoes, hand-cut right in the store, then cooked to perfection in 100% sunflower oil and served piping hot. Now that's a side order worth singing about. That's what hamburgers are about. Everyone has a horizon, the line you can't see past. Before it, the familiar. Beyond it, the unknown. Enter the all-new Lexus GX. It's designed to be capable. It's designed to be luxurious. But most of all, it's designed to get you past your horizon. And the nice thing about horizons is that once they're crossed, there's always another patiently waiting its turn. Live up to it. The all-new Lexus GX. Experience amazing at your Lexus dealer. Hey, it's Mark Cuban, and you're listening to the home of the Mavs, 97.1 The Freak. Stan and Brad Davis at the American Airlines Center start of the third quarter. Golden State 54, the Mavericks 52. Brad, the, the one stat that really stands out right now uh, beyond the, the rebounding, which Golden State has an eight-rebound edge. Dallas, nine turnovers, 14 points off the turnovers for Golden State, which doesn't generally force many turnovers themselves. They're really... Uh, 13 turnovers per game. It's 23rd in the NBA, and the Mavericks had 17 on Tuesday night against them, and they were kind of on that pace again tonight. Well, most of the turnovers that they've had is getting in the traffic, getting up in the air. Golden State does a good job of collapsing on defense. Curry has it as we start the third. Warriors in white, trim with blue and gold. Chris Paul on the board. The curling Thompson in the lane. Laid off. Jackson Davis underneath the basket. Not in a shooting position. Tight curl. Curry back to Jackson Davis through the lane. And a whistle on the pass. And a foul against the Mavericks. And it's P.J. Washington who gets called with a foul. The Mavericks actually a little lucky there because Draymond Green was wide open in the corner. Green's had a really good year shooting the ball from behind the line. Right now, at 38.1%, the second highest three-point percentage of his career. Here's Paul to Thompson, top of the circle, hits the jumper on the move away from Kyrie. Nice little curl that time. Warriors 56, and the Mavericks 52. Here comes Exum to Gafford. Styles the three-point line right of the circle. Back door. Washington goes up and lays it in. Chris Paul was right on his back. They didn't blow the whistle as he went over the back. 
and Washington still able to lay it in. 16 for Washington. 56-54. Paul to his right. Diagonal left. Green in the corner. Will take the three. And that rims out. And the rebound taken by Gafford. Ten rebounds for Daniel Gafford. Up the left side, Exum. Right to left drive, spinning, flipping, scoring from the top of the charge circle. Yeah, nice little spin move on Clay Thompson that time. Game tied at 56. Curry, Jackson Davis to give back to Curry through the lane. And a three-pointer on the way from Paul. That's no good. Gafford, his 11th rebound to Irving. Quickly to Exum. On the drive, left to right through the lane. And to the trailing, Derek Jones will walk into a three. And that's long and left. Gafford, the offensive rebound. Out to Washington, the left wing. Into the left corner. Finds Jones in the lane. Misses the layup. Tips in the rebound. Good, nice job staying with that one. Mavericks go in front. 58-56. Again, this game very similar to the game on Tuesday night. Maybe a little less physical, but still very close all the way through. Thompson, middle of the lane, hits it again. One difference, Clay Thompson starting to find his shot. Yeah, anytime he can get going left, shoot that little pull up, he's pretty effective. He's got 11, tied at 58. Exum, Gafford, Green chesting up on him. Bounce pass for Washington, turns off to Jackson Davis and flips it in. 18. For P.J. Washington, 60 to 58. Middle of the floor, Paul. Veering to his right. Curling is Curry. Laid off to Jackson Davis and knocked away by Washington. What a play. Comes out of there with it, four on three. On the drive, Euro step right and fouled, and he'll go to the line to shoot. Nice defensive play. Came over, got that block late. Started the fast break himself. Say, Golden State runs that split action that uh, Steve Kerr was talking the other night. It really goes back to the time when he was in Chicago and they were running the triangle. Tim, the Mavericks have done a really good job in the two games, Brad, of not letting Golden State do a lot of finishing at the rim despite what would appear to be an open layup after the initial pass. Now, the weak side help has come over and helped a couple times in this game. First one from Washington is no good. Daniel Gafford, five assists tonight, which ties his career high. Second one from Washington is good, and he's got 19. Gafford, 17 double-figure rebounds this season, six since joining the Mavericks, 61-58. Paul in the starting lineup here at the start of the third quarter in place of Moses Moody, the curling Curry through the lane and a rolling hook off the heel of the rim. Offensive rebound, no, Jackson Davis had it knocked away by Jones in the hands of Washington, now Exum to the trailing Washington. Lays it off for Kyrie Irving. Pulls up from 20 from the left wing and hits. 14 for Irving. And the Mavericks on a 7-0 run right now up 63-58. Green and deep. Jones stripped it away. And it's off of Green out of bounds. That's a terrific defensive play by Derek Jones. 8.45 remaining in the third quarter. And the Mavericks up by five as Exum brings it up. To Gafford on the three-point line right of the circle. Facing up, Green trying to knock it away. He does knock it away. Goes to the floor, and Gafford is going to try to tie him up, and they're going to call a kick ball against Green, and the Mavericks will have it with 14 to shoot. Take Green is just a, a tremendous defender. He really is. Yep, gets up into him. Gives him no room. One-time defensive player of the year. Moses Moody now checks in for the Warriors in to Kyrie for three from the right wing. No good. Gafford, the offensive rebound, lost it, and then gets called for a foul as Chris Paul was trying to come out of the traffic, and that's three fouls on Daniel Gafford. Paul will get it into Curry. Played by Jones. Curry diagonally to his right, hooks it down the right side for Moody. Behind the right hash mark in the middle to Green, reversing it left on the hash mark to Thompson. Will take the three and hit the three over Kyrie. 
And he is starting to feel it. He's got seven in the, uh, make it nine in the quarter. And uh, seven in the quarter, excuse me, and 16 in the game. 63-61. Irving right wing. Washington out top. Left to Jones. Fake left, go right on the drive. Hanging and draws the foul on Green. Second on Green. Second on the Warriors. And two shots coming for Derek Jones. Just the sixth and seventh free throws for the Mavericks. For the season, Jones just under 72% for the foul off. A 14-point game last night, but way short on the first one. He had not many chances at the foul line, Brad. You've got to be able to take advantage of them when you get there. Yeah, and Dallas is doing a nice job attacking. At least they're getting to the free throw line here a little bit here in the third quarter. Second one coming for Jones after two bounces. The spin in his left hand. The foul shot is good. The Mavericks 64, Golden State 61. Four minutes into the third quarter as Paul brings it up against Washington. Bounces intended for Moody and Irving from behind pokes it away out of bounds across the sideline. The Warriors inbound from midway between the midcourt line and the hash mark. Paul looking into green against Gafford. Crossed away left to Thompson against Tim Hardaway who's checked in. Deeper left side Curry along the baseline behind the back to Green against Gafford through the lane to Mo Moody. Four to shoot. Coming around is Thompson. Left to right for three. That is short. And the rebound off the hands of Gafford and taken out of there by Irving who comes up the right side. Irving against Moody to the right of the lane. Spinning left. Over the top to Jones. Left wing three is too hard. Offensive rebound off the hands of Gafford. Taken by Paul. Gafford trails the play. Paul to Moody on the drive around Jones. Missed the layup. Tipped by Green is good with the left hand at the right of the rim. Big time finish for Draymond Green. 64-63, five minutes into the quarter. Stop and go by Kyrie, lost it off his leg. Picked up by Thompson. Here comes Curry on the move, and Irving getting back in the play. Curry tries again, laid off down low. Moody can't shoot against Gafford. Laid off to Paul, left-hand dribble against Gafford on the switch. Measures him, left-hand dribble still. Coming around is Curry, and an offensive foul on Chris Paul. As they tried to set up that screen, and Paul called for throwing out the hit, according to official Brian Forte, and a timeout by the Mavericks. Did you hit the like button? Come on, hit the, the like court. button. It's the and Mavericks subscribe too. The Join the family. On the Dallas Mavericks Radio Network. There are a lot of ways to make whiskey, but only one way to make Jack Daniels. Make it count. Jack Daniels. Please drink responsibly. Tennessee whiskey, 40% alcohol by volume. Jack Daniels Distillery, Lynchburg, Tennessee. Jack Daniels, an old number seven registered trademarks. 2022 Jack Daniels, all rights reserved. After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice cold reward. Medela is the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know, the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours, the energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter, and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. Did you know that responding to one spam call can lead to more? Or that the IRS would never ask for your social security number on the phone? Learn about scams and how to fight them with AARP. Sign up for their Fraud Watch Network alerts and texts and online workshops to help you recognize and avoid the latest scams. Remember, knowledge gives you power over scams. Learn to protect yourself and your loved ones. Visit aarp.org slash fraudwatchnetwork. That's aarp.org slash fraudwatchnetwork. After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice cold reward. Medela is the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours, the energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter, and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. There are a lot of ways to make whiskey, but only one way to make Jack Daniels. Make it count. 
Jack Daniels. Please drink responsibly. Tennessee whiskey, 40% alcohol by volume. Jack Daniels Distillery, Lynchburg, Tennessee. Jack Daniels and old number seven registered trademarks. 2022 Jack Daniels, all rights reserved. Your home for Dallas Mavericks basketball. 97-1, the freak. 6.37 remaining third quarter. Mavericks 64, Warriors 63. Before we start up, let's pause 10 seconds for station identification on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. For Worth Dallas. This is Luka Doncic. Listen out to 97.1 The Freak. The home of the Mavs. 97.1 The Freak. Hey, don't miss the exclusive Mavs market sale this coming Sunday prior to the Mavericks game with the Houston Rockets located on the South Plaza of the American Airlines Center from 10 to 3. You can shop up to 70% off. The first 250 shoppers receive a free gift with a purchase. For more details, visit Mavs.com slash market here in the third Mavericks five of nine shooting there at 50% for the game Golden State four of 11 at 42% for the game and the Mavericks with the ball as Tim Hardaway brings it up to the right to Derek Jones pushes to the curling Kyrie through two got Peyton to fly by from the right of the lane and it rims out the rebound to Kevon Looney to Brandon Pajemski who's checked in the game out of the timeout as well for Golden State and a whistle and a foul on Tim Hardaway with Curry trying to cut through the lane. Hardaway's first. A 13 foul against the Mavericks. Pajinski to inbound from the left sideline. Again, just joining us. No Luka Doncic tonight. Maxi Kleba apparently not available either. No Wiggins and no Kaminga for Golden State. Peyton right to left. Pajinski curling his curry right to left. Now left to right away from Jones. Floats it off the board and in over Kyrie to put Golden State in front. 65-64. Hey, well, Jones is making Curry work out there today, though. Kyrie left to right around Looney and to the rim. Score it with a foul as he banked it in. And a chance of the three-point lay and a beautiful move on the crossover to get away from Looney. Yeah, just put the defense that time, took the hit, laid it in. Bajemski gets called for the foul. That is four on him. And Irving looking for his 17th point of the night. Only two Mavericks in double figures right now. Washington with 19. Irving looking for his 17th point. Fifth in the league in free throw shooting, 90.7%. And the foul shot on the way and good. The Mavericks back in front, 67 to 65. The ninth lead change, we've been tied seven times. Pajemski, right of the jump circle, left hand wrap around to Looney, played by Powell. Curry curls right to left. Played by Jones coming down the lane. Scooping blocked by Powell. Taken by Irving. Skids it to Hardaway on the drive. Nice little sidestep. A miss the layup. The rebound batted out by Peyton in the hands of Looney. Or Moody, excuse me. Now to Looney. Pajemski comes around and gets into the top of the arc against Hardaway. And a back door and... Curry never quite got to where Pajemski thought he was going to get to. Uh, Curry never looked for that. Dante Exum checks in for the Mavericks to replace Derek Jones. That's his in and is out. Brought to you by in and out Burger. That's what a hamburger is all about. Here comes Exum up the right side to Powell. Right of the circle. To the right corner to Hardaway. Right baseline drive. To the left corner. Catch and shoot. Washington three. That's going to be short. Weak side rebound though to Powell. Out to Exum. Passed up the shot. Now to Hardaway. Back to Exum. Right wing. Back to Hardaway. With six to shoot. Flashing his pal. Looking for Washington. On the drive. It'll take the floater and hit it. From just behind the dotted line. 21 for Washington. Seven here in the third. And Washington with a pair of 20 point games against Golden State. In the span of four days, 69-65. Looney right wing to Curry. Pulls up right in line. Banker foul. Missed the shot. Will go to the line. Washington the foul. Two fouls on Washington. Four on the Mavericks. And that'll put Curry on the stripe. And Jason Kidd is going to challenge this. So they'll go... Up to the replay center, and uh, this would be the Mavericks charge timeout of the third quarter in any case. 69-65, Mavericks with the lead with 434 remaining in the third on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. Fly to Philly. 
take off to Tampa, depart for Denver. Following your team on the road is more rewarding with the new American Airlines Advantage program. Your flights and everyday spend not only earn you miles toward your next trip, but also loyalty points toward Advantage status. All the more reason to purchase both a home and a away jersey. With status comes great benefits like priority boarding, free check bags, and complimentary upgrades. Not a member? Enroll for free today at AA.com. American Airlines, you are why we fly. Terms and conditions apply. The NBA app is everyone's app. Every fan of every team. Oh, my goodness. Everyone who follows LeBron, Tatum, and Embiid in the app. Every warrior who's ready to go to battle over three-point percentages. Every streetwear king who's here for the tunnel fits. Every young buck, nugget, and grizzly who wants to take a peek behind the scenes of the league. And everyone else on this floating basketball we call Earth. Download the NBA app today. Available in the Google Play, Apple app, and Android stores. Everyone has a horizon. The line you can't see past. Before it, the familiar. Beyond it, the unknown. Enter the all-new Lexus GX. It's designed to be capable. It's designed to be luxurious. But most of all, it's designed to get you past your horizon. And the nice thing about horizons is that once they're crossed, there's always another patiently waiting its turn. Live up to it. The all-new Lexus GX. Experience amazing at your Lexus dealer. Jefferson Dental and Orthodontics is the official dentist of the Dallas Mavericks and has been trusted for affordable, high-quality dental and orthodontic care since 1967. Your smile is their priority, and they're offering Mavs fans a special deal. For a limited time, you can start Invisalign for as low as $99 down and $74 a month. Text MAVS to 91088 or visit jeffersondentalclinics.com slash MAVS to get this deal. Messaging data rates and terms apply. I'm Kevin Gray here at the Modelo Sports Desk to get you caught up on some scores around the association. We start in New Orleans where the Spurs are up 109 to 106 over the Pelicans on the road with 10 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Meanwhile, games that have gone final, Blazers get the 108-102 win over the Wizards. Pacers get the 126-112 win at home over the Thunder. Hornets win 124-115 over the Orlando Magic. And the Celtics get the one-point win 101-100 over the Sacramento Kings. Mavs now up two and a half games on Sacramento. Let's go back to Chuck Cooperstein at the AAC. As we resume, the Mavericks challenge deemed unsuccessful as uh, Kevin Scott ruling the P.J. Washington move from point A to point B and did not allow Curry a chance to come down. And Curry does not take advantage of his good fortune and misses the free throw. The league's leading free throw shooter, 92.6%, looking for his 14th point. He has it. The Mavericks 69, the Warriors 66, four and a half to play, third quarter. Hardaway brings it up, hands to Exum against Pajemski. Right off of Powell, keeps the dribble through the lane. Left corner, Washington three, hit the front rim, rebound off the hands of Exum, taken by Curry, ahead to Moody, makes the catch against Curry, across the way to Pajemski, catch and shoot three is good, and the game tied at 69. And how about that cross court passing by Golden State? Pretty nice find right there. That is eight for Brandon Pajemski's second three of the game. As Irving in the middle to Hardaway. At the nail, jumper short. He can't find anything right now. Three of 11 from the floor for Hardaway. One of seven from three. Here's Curry on the drive against Powell. In traffic, finding. Looney missed it, wanted a foul. Hardaway the rebound. Mavericks five on three. To the right, Hardaway against Moody. Knocks him down, no foul call. He's short on that. And Peyton with the rebound. Makes the save into Looney. Here comes Pajimski for Golden State. Lost it off his foot. Loose on the floor. And it'll be a jump ball as Moody and Washington tie each other up. Chris Paul. Ready to come back in for Golden State. Clay Thompson as well. Jaden Hardy ready to come back in for the Mavericks, but uh, perhaps for Washington, who will be jumping it at 6 7. Moses Moody, about 6 5 and a half. And actually, Thompson waiting. To come in for Moody. The tip controlled by Washington. And here comes Irving up the left side. 
Irving against Peyton on the drive. Pulls up behind the dotted line too hard. And the rebound taken by Looney. Seven rebounds for Kevon Looney tonight. Golden State is out rebounding the Mavericks 34 to 29. Pajemski right to left. Paul put it on the floor into the lane. Met by Washington. Right to Peyton for three off the left of the rim. No good. And the rebound to Washington. His fifth to Hardaway up the right side at the hash mark to Irving top of the arc pick and roll with Powell drop it off the Powell and foul by Peyton going up nice little dive cut by Dwight Powell that time for Gary Peyton his third foul fourth foul on Golden State and Powell who has played eight minutes in each of the last two games back in the rotation after the Injury to Derek Lively and certainly more time than I with Maxi Kleba. Apparently unavailable to play. First foul shot on the way. Good. Shooting 70% from the line as Hardy checks in the game. Gafford's at the scorer's table. will check in for Powell at the next dead ball. And Clay Thompson back in for Golden State to replace Moody. And one more free throw to try to make it a two-point Maverick lead, and Powell's able to do that. The Mavericks 71, the Warriors 69, 245 remaining in the third. Pajemski to Powell, back to Pajemski on the give and go. Euro step and throws it up and in. I don't know, was he trying to throw a lob? Yeah, I think he's trying <laughs> to throw a lob to Payton. But it went in the basket, tied at 71. Deep right side, Kyrie, nice flash by Powell down low. Missed the layup, though. Great pass by Irving, great cut by Powell, just couldn't finish it. Now Thompson spins right, hooks it to Looney, coming around Pachimski. Two is left on the drive and then steps back down low, Looney underneath, and he's fouled by Powell underneath and he'll go to the line with 2.13 remaining in the quarter. Two on Powell. Tell you, Kevon Looney, just as he did in the Western Conference Finals a couple of years ago, Brad, his physicality has made a difference out here tonight for Golden State. Well, he knows what he does well, and that's rebound. Rebound sets screens, knows his role, and does it well. Looney misses the first one. 68% free throw shooter. Average just four and a half points. Had a long consecutive games played streak come to an end earlier this season 254 consecutive games played before Steve Kerr did not bring him off the bench and one more to come the Warriors 7 of 12 from the line the Mavericks are 6 of 10 here is Looney's free throw that rolls off the rim and the rebound taken out of the traffic by Hardy as Gafford was pushed out of bounds by Peyton and they didn't call that as the ball came off the rim and now foul on Peyton as he pushed Tim Hardaway and that'll put Hardaway on the line as Golden State's over the limit. That was not a good foul yeah. by Peyton who picks up his fourth. Not a smart foul right there about 60 feet away from the basket. So Tim Hardaway on the line his first trip there tonight. 85% free throw shooter. Three bounces on the way, and that's good. Puts the Mavericks in front, 72-71. And here come Jackson Davis and Moody back in the game for Golden State with uh, Peyton and Looney sitting down. Mavericks now with Exum, Hardy, Hardaway, Derek Jones, and Gafford. And Hardaway trying to give the Mavericks a two-point lead, and he does it. Nine for Tim Hardaway, Mavericks 73, Warriors 71. Two minutes remaining, third quarter. Paul across the line on the left. Exum chesting him up as he moves to his right into the jump circle. Screen to the left by Jackson Davis. He rolls. Paul can't get it to him. Secondary curl by Pajimski in the lane and deep. Pivoting in there forever. He hooks it up. That's no good. And the rebound taken by Hardy. Up the right side to Hardaway. Hardaway in deep for Gafford. Turns on Thompson. Missed it on the turnaround. And Pajemski with the rebound. Gafford ties him up for a jump ball. That's a tremendous play by Daniel Gafford. 
with a minute 33 remaining in the third. Did you hit the like button? Come on, Let's hit the like button. And subscribe too. Join the family. To jump it up. And a full shot clock either way. As everybody tries to get themselves lined up around the circle. Kevin Scott will now step in and toss it up. Bad tip. This is a bad toss, but Gafford won the tip. Able to get it to Hardy and now back out to Exum. Along the right side, to his left, back to his right. And over Chris Paul from 12, he hits. That's a nice move. And the pull-up from Exum. Nice little step-back jumper. It's 11 for Dante Exum. The Mavericks with 75 seconds remaining in the third, a four-point lead. At 75-71, Paul drops it to Thompson. To his left against Jones. Puts his head down below the left elbow. Pull-up is short. Long rebound. And Thompson able to run it down in the right corner. Moody for three. It's good to make it a one-point game. That ball hit the floor three times and no Maverick went after the ball Moses Moody with his fifth point his first basket here's Exum hooks it out to Hardy on the drive straight down the lane he'll hang and he'll score put his head down like a fullback on third and one nice finish for Hardy for his fifth point 77 74 final 35 seconds Paul left to right, foul by Hardaway. Not a good foul there. Bad foul by Hardaway. 40 feet from the basket, and you're putting a great free throw shooter on the line. And it gives Golden State a chance to go for the two for one out of it. With 35.6 seconds remaining here in the third. Chris Paul a plus 25 in the first half. As he helped Golden State to a two-point lead, his first one is good. First point here in the third quarter. Draymond Green comes back in for Pajimski, for Steve Kerr for defensive purposes. And one more coming. He's got it. Here comes Exum for the Mavericks in a one-point game. Up the left side. Against Moody across the floor, screened by Gafford, switched onto by Green, curling Hardaway on the drive, and he lost it out of bounds. We'll call a reach in foul first. And Moody gets called for the foul. So Hardaway back to the line with 24.4 remaining. And the game has slowed down here in the last three or four minutes. Yeah, a lot of fouls called here in this uh, third quarter. In the first half, we had just 13 fouls called as Hardaway hits the first one. We've had 13 fouls called here in the third quarter as Washington will come in for Hardy. And Clay Thompson back in to replace Jackson Davis. As again, Steve Kerr playing offense defense. One more coming for Hardaway. Looking for his 11th point on the way, and he rolls it home. 79-76. Curry picked up full court by Derrick Jones. Jones falls down as Curry crossed him over, but Curry slowly to the front court, didn't really try to attack. Now he will off a green screen against Gafford. Backhand pass finds Green at the top of the arc, not looking to shoot. To let the clock run down, find Curry with Jones right there. Green the screen again. Curry backs up, and from below the logo, no good as the horn sounds. That was not a very good possession at all for Golden State. And the Mavericks will take a three-point lead to the fourth quarter. The Mavericks this year have won their last 24 games when leading after three. They are 36-2. and two. Golden State, when trailing after three this year, is 3-22. and 22. The Mavericks 79, the Warriors 76 as we go to the fourth on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. Panini, the exclusive trading card and sticker partner of the NBA, is the home for your favorite Dallas Mavericks collectibles. From trading cards to signed memorabilia, Panini is the place to collect your favorite Mavs players. From high-flying dunks to amazing triple-doubles, go to Panini Instant to get the hottest player highlight cards fresh off the presses. Don't miss out on all the rookie moments to veteran performances. Go to iCollectPanini.com. 
Who do you collect? After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice cold reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know, the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours, the energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter, and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. Prescriptions require an online consultation with a healthcare provider who will determine if appropriate. Restrictions apply. See website for details and important safety information. Subscription required. Price varies based on product and subscription plan. Hey, guys, did you know there's a generic form of Viagra that works just the same but is 95% cheaper? And you can get it online at hymns.com slash radio. Through Hims, you'll get a free medical consultation to determine the ED medication that's best for you. Discreet shipping if prescribed, a 100% online process, and a range of treatment options, including trusted generic alternatives to the name brands, at up to 95% off. ED is personal, and at Hims, so is treating it. Just go to hymns.com slash radio and get connected to a licensed medical provider online for free. With zero copay, no expensive appointments, and no awkward face-to-face -face conversations. To start your free online visit, you need to go to this exclusive address, hymns.com slash radio. That's hymns.com slash radio for your free online visit. H-I-M-S dot com slash R-A-D-I-O. Now back to Dallas Mavericks basketball on 97.1 The Freak. Chuck Cooperstein and Brad Davis at the American Airlines Center start of the fourth quarter. The Mavericks trying to split these two games with Golden State. And uh, in the process, try to gain more ground with San Antonio already having defeated New Orleans tonight. So New Orleans winds up at uh, 10 and 6 in division play as Exum has the top of the arc. The Mavericks shoot to our right, uh, to our left, excuse me. And here is Gafford to the cutting Exum. That's off his hands and picked up by Clay Thompson. Here comes Thompson up the right side. He lost it off his foot, and Washington has it. To X him up the right side. The teams exchange turnovers. To the cutting Washington up top for Gaffer. That's knocked away by Jackson Davis, who got back into the play. Chris Paul, Jackson Davis against Gafford to his right. To Pachimski, left to right, on the drive. Lost the ball. A pair of turnovers each way. Here comes Exum on the push. To the right to Washington. To the rim. He will score with a foul on Chris Paul. And a chance for three for P.J. Washington. Tying his Mavericks high with 23 points. Yeah, Dallas taking advantage of the turnover by Golden State. Pushed it. Nice find by Exum. For the Mavericks just their ninth fast break point of the night. Dante Exum tying a season high and assist with seven on that pass to Washington. The free throw is good. And for P.J., his fourth 20-point game as a member of the Mavericks, his 13th overall this year, 82-76. First minute of the fourth. Jackson Davis to his right to Paul on the weave. And nice backdoor Draymond Green up top, and that's knocked away. Oh, Kyrie knocked that away, and it's saved by Hardaway into Exum. Deep right side, cuts to his left, to the trailing Hardaway, Hill attack, got around Chris Paul, to Washington left to right, behind him to Kyrie, Hill attack, up top, Gaffer throws it down, and a timeout by Steve Kerr, and a great start to the fourth quarter for the Mavericks, they score the first five, they lead it by eight, with 10.42 remaining, 84-76 on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. With the Kroger app, shopping online with pickup and delivery is the same as shopping in-store. Same low prices, same personalized deals, same rewards on the same high-quality items like Honeycrisp apples and pasta sauce with no hidden fees or markups. It's one small click for groceries, one big win for busy families everywhere. Start your cart today at Kroger.com. Kroger, fresh for everyone. Restriction supply, see site for details. The Dallas Morning News has been running a full court press since 1885. Always going hard in the print. With no timeouts. Don't miss breaking news on broken ankles. We cover the game from assist to zone D and everything in between. Visit dallasnews.com slash Mavs for an exclusive digital offer. 
It's your chance to experience all the thrilling Mavericks basketball action live and in the stands. From the minute they hit the court to the moment when the final bucket is made, don't miss a single play this season. As the official ticket marketplace of the Dallas Mavericks, Ticketmaster has got you covered with the largest selection of seats of any marketplace. Grab your tickets now at Ticketmaster.com slash Mavericks. TXU Energy is changing the game with Live Your Free, the first and only plan of its kind that automatically adapts each month to give you free energy when you use it most. What if I use the most during the day? Enjoy free energy all day, every day. What if I suddenly become a night owl? Your nights are free automatically. What if I go weekend warrior? Free energy all weekend, my friend. So the savings change with me. And you never have to change a thing. TXU Energy. Energy for everything. Free energy charges and time periods defined in plan EFL. TDU and other bill charges apply normally. Visit TXU.com for details. Hey, it's Mark Cuban, and you're listening to the home of the Mavs, 97.1 The Freak. Meet Brad Davis's former teammate, Rolando Blackman, at the free market fair happening tomorrow here at the American Airlines Center from 1030 until 2 o'clock. You can shop local businesses, support Mavs business assist entrepreneurs, and nonprofits. Visit Mavs.com slash ERG for more information. 1042 remaining in the fourth quarter, and the Mavericks have increased their lead to 8 at 84-76. And Brad, what a monster game for P.J. Washington tonight. 24 points. Five rebounds, two assists, three steals, and two block shots. Yeah, without Luke in the lineup, you wonder where the scoring was going to come from. He's definitely provided it tonight. Well, you thought it might come more even from Kyrie, but Washington has been the one. Here's Curry back in the game, and a whistle away from the play, and a foul call by Kevin Scott. Tim Hardaway gets called for the foul. And the first team foul on the Mavericks here in the fourth quarter as Hardaway picks up his third. On the right side, Paul to inbound the ball. He gets it to Curry. To his left, excellent bump by Jackson Davis on the screen. Curry, wide to his left, cuts to his right, got the Gortat screen, and hits the scoop from the top of the charge circle. Just kept the dribble alive to find that opening. 16 for Steph Curry, 84-78. Irving back in the game for the Mavericks along the right side against Thompson. Bounce pass, gives it to Exum, away from Curry, and he'll float it on up, and it rims out Gafford, offensive rebound, had it knocked away from him by Paul. And Paul spins to his right across the midcourt line. Stop and go toward the right baseline. Whips it cross court, finds Thompson, catches, shoot three, front rimmed it, rebound. And Washington lost to the Kyrie, and a run out now for Hardaway, and he'll dunk it with two hands. No transition defense for Golden State. Now nobody back for him. 86-78, Curry knocks over Exum, and a blocking foul called on Exum. The first on Exum, second against the Mavericks. Derek Jones ready to come back in for the Mavericks. And Exum will sit down. Paul to inbound from the left sideline. Watched by Washington. Got it into Curry against Derek Jones. Screen by Jackson Davis. Curry pull up three. Hit it. Oh, tough shot. Quick move to his left to free himself yeah, up. It was a deep one, too. 19 for Curry. Now three of seven from three. 86 81. 925 remaining. Kyrie sidestep right. Couldn't get it away. Out to Hardaway on the drive. Left elbow behind him to Washington against Chris Paul as they bump. He lost the ball. Went to the ground. And a timeout taken by Jason Kidd to protect the possession. With 9.14 remaining in the fourth quarter, it's the Mavericks 86 and the Warriors 81 on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. Everyone has a horizon. Before it, the familiar. Beyond it, the unknown. Enter the all-new Lexus GX. It's designed to be capable. It's designed to be luxurious. But most of all, it's designed to get you past your horizon. And the nice thing about horizons is that once they're crossed, there's always another patiently waiting its turn. Live up to it. The all-new Lexus GX. Click the banner to discover more. Experience amazing at your Lexus dealer. At In-N-Out, our hamburgers are made with the highest quality ingredients. Made fresh and by hand. Made with a smile to put a smile on your face. Made for special occasions or no occasion at all. Made with gratitude for every customer we get to serve. 
Most of all, every hamburger, cheeseburger, and double-double is made to order just for you. After the end of a good fight, you deserve an ice-cold reward. Medela is the mark of a fighter. You've earned this rich golden lager with a crisp, refreshing taste. Because you know, the bigger the fight, the better the reward. You put in the hours, the energy, the tough labor. You are a fighter. and Medela is your reward. Medela, the mark of a fighter. Drink responsibly. Beer imported by Crown Import, Chicago, Illinois. As an educator, I want to ignite a fire within my students to push them to dig deeper, question more, and create something beautiful. And with guaranteed lifetime income from TIAA, I'm able to focus more on helping my students define and change their futures because I know TIAA is there helping take care of mine. Work passionately. Retire confidently. Learn more at TIAA.org slash never run out. Annuities issued by Teachers Insurance and Annuity Association of America. New York, New York. Guarantees subject to its claims paying ability. The Mavs play here. You're listening to 97.1 The Freak. I'm Kevin Gray here at the Modelo Sports Desk to get you caught up with the scores around the association. Two that we'll focus on that directly affect the Mavericks. Celtics get the 101-100 win over the Sacramento Kings as the Kings fall to 44-33 and on the season. With the loss, the Kings fall to two and a half games behind the Dallas Mavericks pending the outcome of tonight's game as they remain eighth in the West. Meanwhile, the Pelicans get the 109 or excuse me, the Spurs get the 111-109 win over the Pelicans, which means the Mavericks clinch the tiebreaker with the best division, better division record over the Pelicans. Let's go back to Chuck Cooper's name. Kevin, thanks, and uh, thanks for correcting me for what I said earlier. I had the wrong number as it related to the Pelicans, who wound up 9-7 and seven in the Southwest Division. The Mavericks are 10-5, and five, so uh, if it does come to a division tiebreaker, that works in the Mavericks' favor, who have the ball leading 86-81. Jones inbounds to Gafford, back to Jones. Top of the arc with Draymond Green against the clock, forcing it up. 24-second violation as the Mavericks did not have a lot going there off that out-of-bounds play. The 14th turnover for the Mavericks, their third here in the fourth quarter. Jackson Davis into Curry, who fell down, taking that inbound pass. And Curry will bring it up. Jones backpedaling as Curry works to his right. They try to trap him. They back out of the trap. Curry to his left, pull up three. That rims out. And the rebound, Gaffer tips it to Hardaway. And here comes Irving on the push up the right side. Pulls up over Thompson for three. Chases low, rebound down. In the traffic, he's fouled. It'll go to the line to shoot. Blake Thompson never put a body on him. Irving knew it was going to be short. All went it up. Chris Paul picks up the foul. And that is four fouls on Chris Paul. Two team fouls on Golden State here in the fourth. Of course, the fourth quarter. Kyrie Irving time in his last four games 49 fourth quarter points as he hits the first one for his first of the fourth quarter tonight as Gary Payton comes in to replace Thompson but Jimsky comes in for Paul for Golden State did the Mavericks playing without Luka without Maxi Kleba who they would love to have in these fourth quarter situations to play the small ball five and the Warriors playing without Andrew Wiggins and Jonathan Kaminga tonight as Kyrie sinks two free throws a 19 point game for him the Mavericks a seven point lead 88 to 81 green along the left side to Curry backs up near midcourt to his left off T Jackson Davis now met by Gafford left hand wraparound deflected by Washington into the hands of Hardaway another Golden State turnover here comes Kyrie across the way to Hardaway to the cutting Washington down low for the layup terrific pass by Hardaway another Steve Kerr timeout with 824 remaining in the fourth quarter and that'll leave Golden State with just two timeouts remaining 90-81, the Mavericks with the lead on the Dallas Mavericks radio network. Dub Nation, get ready for the splash. Splash for Clay. This is Clay Thompson, and you can hear nonstop NBA clips and interviews with the SiriusXM app. 
or TRE at Victory Station. It's the easiest way to catch tip-off from your seat, not the parking lot. Come on, the train versus the car? It's a no-brainer. With fares starting at just 3 bucks, you'll have plenty of cash left over for some Mavs merch or snacks. Get the adrenaline rush from the game action and forget rushing to beat the traffic before the final buzzer. Train service fast and right to the arena with Dart. Oh, yeah, now you're thinking... There are a lot of ways to make whiskey, but there's only one way to make Jack Daniels. Jack could have been like any other whiskey. Instead, we charcoal mellow every drop through 10 feet of hard sugar maple charcoal. We use water from Cave Spring Hollow in Lynchburg, Tennessee. It's no coincidence that Jack is what it is today. Because when you make your own label, you make everything else yours too. But we don't need to tell you that, do we? Make it count. Jack Daniels. Please drink responsibly. Tennessee whiskey, 40% percent call by volume. Jack Daniels, distillery, Lynchburg, Tennessee. Jack Daniels, and old number seven, registered trademark. 2022 Jack Daniels, all rights reserved. Hey, it's Mark Cuban. You better be listening to the home of the Dallas Mavericks, 97-1, The Freak. Sign your child up for Ashley's Ball Kid today. Text Ashley to 79975. Ashley, America's number one furniture and mattress store. 824 remaining fourth quarter. Mavericks 90, the Warriors 81. As Pajemski brings it up for Golden State to green as the Warriors shoot to our right. Hawks by Washington. Pushes back to Pajemski at the left wing against Derek Jones. They try to set up a screen for Curry. They can't get in the ball right now. Now Curry trying to come up. Green, diagonal right baseline. Murray through the lane, and he finds Peyton in the left corner for three, and he hit it. Moses Moody with a terrific pass. Yeah, this baseline bounce pass. Gary Peyton with his first three of the night. Golden State now 11 of 27 from three, 41%. It's 90 to 84. Irving, pick and roll with Gafford, played by Moody. Step out by Curry, picks up the dribble, right to Hardaway. Cutting is Irving down the lane, back out to Jones for a left wing three, it's good! The Mavericks began the game five of nine from three, now just 10 of 30. So five for the last 21 and a big one for Jones there. Here's Moody right wing, put it on the floor at the foul line, blocked by Jones, taken down by Irving. Kyrie on the push, right to left. Peyton racing back, knocked it away, and then Kyrie bounced it on the baseline, and Golden State will get it back. Tell you what, a lot of selling out right now for both of these teams. Good hustle coming up from behind, knocking that one away. Unfortunate for the Mavericks after the great block by Derek Jones, the eighth block for the Mavericks tonight. Jones with two of them, Washington has two. Gafford with three, and Kyrie with one. Curry behind the left hash mark to his right. Driving, lays it off, knocked away by Washington from Green, but it rolls to Pajimski to his right on the drive, and he'll hang, and that's no good, and tipped in by Moody coming in from behind. The Mavericks 93, the Warriors 86, 650 remaining. Exum back in the game out of the timeout with him along the right side against Payton. Inside the hash mark, in the middle for Irving. Hardaway slips the screen, gets the pass, laid off right corner, didn't have enough on it. Peyton the steal. Here comes Curry on the move, up the middle, lay it off to Moody. He'll lay it in. 93-88. Hardaway at the left hash mark, hands to Kyrie against Peyton. Washington screen. Kyrie to his right, pull up three, hit it. Beautiful tight curl by Kyrie to hit that pull up. Yeah, didn't have much room on that one, but knocked it down. 22 for Irving, his second three of the night. Now Green finds Curry left of the circle three. No good, long rebound to Irving. Two on two with Washington on the drive to the rim. Scoop it on up, no good. Draws the foul against Draymond Green. The third on Green, the third team foul against Golden State. The Mavericks by eight. New Orleans has already lost tonight. Sacramento has already lost tonight. And Kyrie stepping to the line. Phoenix is up 14 on Minnesota in the second minute of the second quarter. Clippers play later against Utah. First one from Irving is good. Jaden Hardy checks in for the Mavericks. As he takes Hardaway's place. Hardy, Jones, Irving, Washington, and Exit for the Mavericks. Midway through the fourth. And Kyrie trying to give the Mavericks a 10-point lead. 
sets, shoots, hits. The Mavericks 98, the Warriors 88. But Jemski will bring it across the line, met at half court by Exum. Pushes it left to Green. Drops it down to Pajemski against Exum on the block to the cutting green, and he's got a dunk. And one of the few times that the split action has really hurt the Mavericks yeah, tonight. He went for the double team that time, and Green made a nice cut. 16 for Brandon Pajemski, who has really played well in four games against the Mavericks this year. 98 to 90. Exum drops it to Washington. Left to the circle. Pivots left. Finds Kyrie, double, back out to Washington, right to Exum, extra pass, Hardy, right corner three, way short, underside of the rim, Pajimski the rebound. Against Hardy as he backs up to Green in the middle of the floor. Coming around is Curry, drop it off on the pick and roll, Pajimski up top, and Peyton with the slam to the right of the rim. And again, the beautiful ball movement for Golden State. 98-92, five minutes remaining. Exum along the right side. Right corner, Washington. Trying to go through the double team. Can't lost the ball to Green. Here comes Curry. Curry, left hand push, Pajimski. Left wing, good closeout by Exum, so he couldn't shoot. Behind him now to Green, looking low pass blocked by Washington. And then knocked away by Jones from Pajimski. And here comes Jones up the right side. Cross court to the top of the arc, where Washington knocks down the three. What a night for P.J. Washington, a Mavericks high, 29 points, and a nine-point game, 101-92. Curry in and out to his left, trying to draw the foul. He does against Derrick Jones, and he'll go to the line. The first one on Jones. Three team fouls against the Mavericks. Hardy leaves. Gafford comes in. Chris Paul comes back in for the, Ma for the uh, Warriors. And Pajemski leaves. Moody leaves too. Clay Thompson coming back in. Yeah, Steve Kerr is going to get his guys in there that score some points, try to get him back in this thing. Yeah, they call that foul on the floor. Curry thought he was in the act of shooting. So the Warriors will inbound from the left side with 421 to play. Paul looking into Curry against Jones. Cross screen by Green. He slips out of it, gets the ball at the nail. Left corner, Chris Paul, tee up the three. Air ball over the top and out of bounds. And last touch by Gary Payton. Oh no, Shea Flores, the outside official, overrules and says it'll be Golden State's ball. With eight seconds for Golden State to shoot. Payton looking into Green. Back out to Thompson to the curling Curry. Blocked by Jones. Comes down with the ball, and he's fouled by Curry. Those have been two absolutely amazing blocks for Derrick Jones here in the fourth quarter. I tell you what, he has done a super job on Curry. That Steph Curry came into the game tonight shooting 26% against the Mavericks, 14 of 53. He is 6 of 18 tonight. Absolutely fantastic, almost defensive player of the year stuff from Derrick Jones as Washington will bring it up for the Mavericks. Against Chris Paul, going for the steal. Kyrie coming to get it over, played by Peyton. Cut back door. Kyrie got the ball in the lane, laid up for Gafford. That's off his hands and out of bounds. And a pretty wild exchange as both Green and Gafford hit the deck. Green took a pretty good shot to the face. So Golden State's ball, just under four minutes remaining. The Mavericks 101, the Warriors 92. As the floor crew taking care of business underneath the basket where Green was prone after he and Gafford got together. Chris Paul will bring it up against Washington, picked up full court. In the middle of the floor, in the jump circle. Paul, wrap around to Green, pivots to his right, to Thompson, quick release for three ways short. Curry the offensive rebound, and put it up and in on the one-timers. He got inside of Kyrie Irving. 21 for Steph Curry. 101-94, three and a half to play. Exum bounces to Gafford. Green all over him. Gafford pivots, hands to Kyrie. Gafford slips out of the screen. 
Kyrie against Payton to his right. Pulls up right of the lane, and that's short. The rebound off the hands of Gaffer, picked up by Paul. Ahead to Curry on the move to the rim. Lay it up. No good. Foul by Jones. It's nothing easy for Steph Curry tonight, though. Again, like Tuesday night, really nothing easy for either team. And frankly, go back to the game in mid-March. The Mavericks won that game 109 to 99. Golden State shot just 40.2% in that game and needed a couple of baskets late to get to that number. Now Curry, 21 points, five rebounds, four assists, three of four from the line tonight. First one's good with 309 remaining. Eight of his 22 have now come here in the fourth quarter. The Warriors, 10 of 16 from the line. Mavericks are 15 of 19. Second one by Curry is perfect. It's an 8 to 3 run for Golden State that has them within five. Mavericks had a 10 point lead at 98 to 88 earlier here in the fourth. Exum trying to get it to Kyrie. Played tightly by Peyton. At the right hash mark, behind his back, left to right. Keeps the dribble in the lane. And with the left hand, wrap around Gafford, blocked by Green. Gafford got it back this time and stuffs it. Green stuffed Gafford late in the game. The defensive player of the game on Tuesday night. He got him again, but this time Gafford had an answer. 103 to 96. Here's Curry on the move against Washington. Stop and go. Left hand wrap around Green. Not looking to shoot. Right to Curry, who will shoot. Air ball into the hands of Irving as Jones took a shot on the back of his head. And now finally coming up the floor with 220 remaining. Exum against Thompson. Right to left. Back to his right. Driving on Thompson. Back out Jones. He'll drive on Curry. Against Green to the rim. Came up short. As he tried to bank it. Green the rebound to Curry. To Peyton on the drive. He'll score with a foul. As Kyrie Irving put a hand in the back of Peyton. He just needed to let him go. Yeah, nice look over the top by Curry. 2.06 remaining. Peyton with seven here in the fourth quarter. His eighth double-figure game of the season. He has 11 on five of six shooting. Foul shot is good by the son of the glove, Gary Payton the second. 103-99, two minutes remaining. We're in crunch time now. Mavericks 21-9. Warriors 22 and 22. They played more clutch games than any team in the NBA. Irving from left to right. Right wing Washington. Back to Kyrie. Four to shoot. And three to the top of the circle. Pull up. Good! Nine in the fourth quarter for Kyrie. 26 in the game. 105-99. A minute 35 remaining. Behind his back. Left to right. Curry against Jones. Measuring him. Goes cross court to Green. Curry trying to back out. They'll cut to Peyton instead, and he lays it up and then got away from Jones. Yeah, nice backdoor cut. Good find by Green. 105 to 101, a minute 25 remaining. Exum across the line on the right against Thompson. Inside the arc, now back out. Peyton overplaying Kyrie as Exum will now try to attack, try to turn the corner along the baseline. Comes up the other side and will throw up a hook shot. It's short. And Green with the rebound. Middle outlet to Curry with 105 remaining. 105-101. Here's Curry right to left. 30-footer. It's good. And a timeout by Jason Kidd. 58.7 seconds remaining. Curry with 11 here in the fourth quarter. And what was a 10-point Maverick lead here in the fourth is down to one at 105 to 104. Curry, you expect to come up big. He's the NBA's leading clutch scorer. 181 points coming into the game tonight. He's got 11 here in the fourth and of course of those three in clutch time. But you don't expect Gary Payton to be an offensive force and he's come up with 10 here in the fourth and 14 of the game. Yeah, just moving around, getting to the open spots and they're finding them. 12 to four run for Golden State to make it a one point game. And let's see what Jason Kidd's able to draw up here. His after timeout plays of late have really been good. They've gotten the Mavericks some great shots. 
And they may need to make one or two more in order to win this one. Well, I could see them getting Kyrie Irving coming off the screen down low, running a little curl, getting the ball in his hands at the top of the key. In the fourth quarter, the Mavericks 9 of 17 from the floor, but they've turned it over six times here in the fourth quarter. 18 total for the game, 23 points for the Warriors. Golden State has turned it over 15 times for 16 Dallas points. Mavericks shooting 47.6%, Golden State 43.8. Mavericks will inbound from the left sideline with Hardaway. Jones, Washington, Irving, and Exum on the floor as well. And Hardaway looks. Kyrie coming to get it. Now against Gary Payton as he holds the ball. They show the corral. He'll go across the court to Hardaway, to the right corner to Jones. With 12 to shoot, out to Hardaway. Kyrie comes and gets it against Payton. Here comes the double from Paul to Hardaway. Right side, Jones. Right corner, three. That's way off. It hit the board first. And the rebound to Curry. Here comes Curry, right to left. Pulls up over Jones for three. And Golden State does not lead as he missed it. Hardaway the rebound. In traffic. Ahead to Irving. It's two on two. In the lane. Washington to the rim. He missed it. And a blocking foul. Called on Curry with 21.6. I had all the anticipation of Curry as open as Curry's going to be. And he doesn't need a whole lot of space. And he was really open. And now Steve Kerr is going to call a timeout and try to challenge this call with 21.6 seconds remaining. And the Mavericks up by 1, 105 to 104. Yeah, I didn't think Kerr got out of the restricted area to get a chance to see it here. Golden State is challenging the block and foul call on Curry. His heel was on the line. His heel was on the line when the contact took place. Twenty one point six seconds to go Kevin Scott Brian Forte on the headset up to Secaucus Tony brothers Nick Booker Scott wall Nate green Checking things out Suyas Meta also in Secaucus I guess the question now is was his heel up in the air yeah, as opposed be to being down thing. It's hard to tell from that overhead angle. They're going to have to get some sort of side view. Yeah, they'll take yeah. their time on this one. 21.6 seconds remaining. 105, 104. Is Washington shooting free throws? Or is Golden State the owner of the ball with one final chance to win the game and come from 10 down here in the fourth? Mavericks led by as many as 16 early in the game at 29 to 13 with uh, just under eight minutes having been played. The Warriors then responded with a 21 to two run to grab the lead. We went back and forth basically through two and a half quarters. And here's Kevin Scott. Well, first telling the table what's going on. And still telling the table what he wants. All right, here we go. After review, the defender, Curry's right heel, was above the restricted area line at the time of the illegal contact. So therefore, it is a restricted area blocking foul. The challenge will be unsuccessful. Golden State will lose a timeout, and Dallas will shoot two shots. The game clock will be reset for 22.5 seconds. Well, that's a rule I didn't know. It was up in the air, but it's still above the restricted area. So they call it a charge. Call it a block. Or, or I mean, a block. They call it a block? Yeah. So Washington, a 68.9% free throw shooter, will go to the line. He is 2 of 3 tonight. 29 points. Looking for his... Third 30-point game of the season. His first as a member of the Mavericks. And two bigger free throws he has not shot all season.
Two bounces, three bounces. Spin it. Flex the knees. Shoot it way short. Golden State still with a timeout remaining. Mavericks also with a timeout remaining. Everybody trying to get themselves lined up on the lane. Washington stood right at the foul line, did not back off after missing that first one. Second one on the way, that's good. And Steve Kerr's not going to call a timeout. Golden State with plenty of time to get it up the floor and run what they're going to run. Chris Paul bring it up, everybody on their feet. Paul on the left side of the floor. Curry comes up the screen and slip. Gets it, turns on Jones. He'll shoot a two from the baseline. He hits it. With 12.4 seconds remaining, the Mavericks are not going to call a timeout. They are going to call a timeout. And you kind of get yourself in that no man's land, Brad, right around this time. You know, do you call the timeout and advance the ball, or do you just take it from the baseline and play with momentum coming up the floor? Yeah, it's probably a good timeout here, though, because they were a little scrambled on that after that made bucket. Now they can run a good play, can run some time off the clock, take that last shot. Steph Curry, 28 points. 14 of them have come here in the fourth quarter. Tied at 106. The Mavericks playing a team in the Warriors that has played a ton of close games. They are 4 and 10 in games decided by three points or fewer. That's the most losses in the NBA in such games. The Mavericks all year have played only six games that have been decided by three points or fewer. And the Mavericks have not played an overtime game. We thought they might play one a couple of weeks ago against Denver, and Kyrie pulled out the miracle, and we'll see if they can avoid overtime tonight. Golden State has played five overtime games this year. They're one and four in overtime. Mavericks will inbound from the right sideline. 12.4 seconds remaining. Excellent inbound. Watched by Thompson. As he looks, he'll enter to Kyrie. They double him. Dribbles out of a double team. They chase him the half. Did you hit the light button? Hardaway on the drive. Up top. Washington the catch. He lays it in with four and a half seconds to go. And a timeout by Steve Kerr. Okay. Let's uh, reel it back to Cleveland, Ohio. February 27th. P.J. Washington. A layup. Looked like he might have been fouled in Cleveland with 2.6 seconds to go. And we know what happened there. We'll see if that can be avoided here. But, boy, what a great pass by Hardaway and terrific recognition on the weak side from Washington. Yeah, did a nice job of cutting his. His man left him to go help. Got right in there. Good find by Hardaway. 11 in the fourth quarter for Washington. 108 to 106 two thrillers for the Mavericks and the Golden State Warriors in the span of four days and I'll tell you what Brad with both teams playing on the second of a back-to-back -back, the energy that has been expended tonight has really been impressive yeah both teams played hard had a playoff atmosphere to it Mavericks trying to make it 13 wins in the last 15 games Golden State trying to make it seven in a row Mavericks knocked off the Rockets on Sunday when they had the NBA's longest winning streak. Will they knock off the Warriors tonight when they have the longest winning streak in the NBA? Four and a half seconds to go. Paul will inbound the ball. The Mavericks were going to double Curry so that Paul will have a free throw as Paul looks, still looks. Into Curry by half court, turns on Washington, help from Irving to Paul, right side Thompson for three, no good short, game over, and the Mavericks have ended the Warriors' six-game winning streak in dramatic fashion as they defeat the Warriors tonight, 108 to 106 for victory number 47 on the season. Yeah, they did a nice job, took the ball out of Curry's hands, clock is running down. Thompson had to hurry up a three, not even close. So how about 
the night that P.J. Washington had. 32. They needed it. They, they needed every, it. Every bit of it. 32 points. Five rebounds. Three assists. Two blocks. And five steals. And the game-winning basket with four and a half seconds to go. That allowed the Mavericks to win this one in a game again, Brad, where you know the scoring at times kind of hard to come by, but they got the shots that they needed, and they played the defense that they needed. Yeah. Even with Curry getting as hot as he got in the fourth quarter, they still hold the Warriors to 44% shooting for yeah, the game. Turned them over too. Played well defensively. Tremendous win for the Mavericks. 13 wins in their last 15 games, and uh, very much in control of their spot at number five in the Western Conference. They defeat the Warriors tonight, 108 to 106. Our post-game show, including a trip inside the Mavericks locker room, is next on the Dallas Mavericks Radio Network. For Worth Dallas. This is Luka Doncic. Listen out to 97.1 The Freak. The home of the Mavs. 97.1 The Freak. Did you know that responding to one spam call can lead to more? Or that the IRS would never ask for your social security number on the phone? Learn about scams and how to fight them with AARP. Sign up for their Fraud Watch Network alerts and texts and online workshops to help you recognize and avoid the latest scams. Remember, knowledge gives you power over scams. Learn to protect yourself and your loved ones. Visit aarp.org slash fraudwatchnetwork. That's aarp.org slash fraudwatchnetwork. Watch Network. What do basketball and banking have in common? To win, you need the right team. That's where Chime comes in. They're changing the game. There are no monthly fees, and with direct deposit, you can get your paycheck up to two days early. Chime even provides fee-free overdraft on debit card purchases with SpotMe. And as the official partner of the Dallas Mavericks, Mavs fans already have Chime on their team. So if you're looking for a layup, open a Chime account today at Chime.com. Chime, banking that has your back. Early direct deposit depend on the payer. SpotMe eligibility requirements and limits apply. Go to Chime.com for details. Chime is a financial technology company, not a bank. Banking services provided by the bank or bank or Stride Bank, N.A., members FDIC. Fly to Philly, take off to Tampa, depart for Denver. Following your team on the road is more rewarding with the new American Airlines Advantage program. Your flights and everyday spend not only earn you miles toward your next trip, but also loyalty points toward Advantage status. All the more reason to purchase both a home and a away jersey. With status comes great benefits like priority boarding, free check bags, and complimentary upgrades. Not a member? Enroll for free today at AA.com. American Airlines, you are why we fly. Terms and conditions apply. Panini, the exclusive trading card and sticker partner of the NBA, is the home for your favorite Dallas Mavericks collectibles. From trading cards to signed memorabilia, Panini is the place to collect your favorite Mavs players. From high-flying dunks to amazing triple-doubles, go to Panini Instant to get the hottest player highlight cards fresh off the presses. Don't miss out on all the rookie moments to veteran performances. Go to iCollect collectpanini.com who do you collect at comerica bank we believe every business should have equal access to opportunities and resources that's why we created comerica co-work spaces free for any comerica small business customer book an office access tech use a meeting room network with other business owners and more all for free to learn more about how comerica supports all small businesses visit comerica.com spaces member fdic equal opportunity lender comerica co-workspaces is available to comerica customers only